ten, 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 like, ten. There's a lot of gayer things. Even yeah. I know that. Well, I guess that's what the first thing we're going to talk about. So we're already talking about yeah, it. No, yeah, no, we're on it. Homophobic comments on <laughs> YouTube videos. Oh, yeah. Should I start us off? Yeah, start us off, and let's just get right into it. Yeah. Okay. Hey, welcome to Size 10 Podcast. Um, it, be sure to like and subscribe and follow us on all on all streaming services. Um, we love <laughs> Netflix, <laughs> Hulu, Hulu. <laughs> Wait, Peacock, did I say that wrong? Disney Plus, Paramount, Disney, Paramount, Paramount. HBO. We branch out. Peacock. <laughs> yeah. All this stuff. Some big news for the size ten fellas. Yeah. Amazon Prime. <laughs> yeah, we could we could probably get on CISO. I Do feel like that's kind of that our speed. Does that even still exist? No. Okay. Yeah. You're gonna be the king of CISO. Yeah, we could. I have no idea what CISO is. So no, CISO, that's, that's why it doesn't exist. Exactly. Oh, okay. exactly. I know what, I can I can give the whole background of CISO. What it was was it was a uh, platform just for comedy. It was like a comedy was like uh, NBC trying to do a Comedy Central essentially. Okay. Yeah. So they produced. So in our world, it was like everyone got a CISO special. Ev- like so many people that like couldn't get specials got their first special like made. <laughs> And then so many people that couldn't get their their shows made, like it was a little more fringe. Like you could get, mm. and and what it was was it, I was, think it was NBC. A lot more fringe. It yeah, was anti dry bar. Dude, the content on there was so good, and it was three ninety nine a month. I definitely subscribed. Mm. I watched like every special. Like Rory Scovel's first special was on there. Like mm. it was all this mm. stuff. And what happened was it actually, in the grand scheme of things. It, it got shut down because it was not successful according to the numbers that NBC mm. expects. Okay. So, so silly. in it a just streaming didn't, it service. It didn't meet like the shareholders' expectations. And so basically. they were like, cut it. And it was right. like, um, no, but it was actually successful. Like it right. actually was successful. There was so many really, really well done shows that are either lost now or because they own, they own all of them. Sure. They'll probably show up on Peacock. Yeah. There was this like um, there was this one that was a parody of of those um, like those like Beverly Hills uh, like um, like, I don't know. like yeah no 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 the one where they like it's like a firm that like sells real estate oh. in an area oh, like selling sunset yeah yeah, yeah yeah exactly it was a parody of that and mm-hmm. it was so good oh. it was so good and it had all these like all your crazy character. Um, comedians showing up as mm. like buyers or sellers or whatever, and I it was watch that. That's it was, there was like four seasons of it. It's so How good. Lot, oh yeah, like all the time I think about like I wish I had Spotify that was just comedy albums and like s- from different like labels and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like I would absolutely pay for that. And it was like four dollars. I remember yeah. I was like, mm, yeah, I'll do this. You're probably still paying for it. You should check. No, it. no. <laughs> I, so, <laughs> but yeah, the story was that the, that NBC just was like. It's only making, it's like, we only have a million subscribers, whatever. It, it was like not, they were, they wanted way more. But it's like, if you're making a fringe product, right. well, that's a lot. Well, probably for them didn't make sense, like, for what they were paying yeah. people to do it. Sure. Probably like, just didn't bring yeah. in enough. True, true. Comedy yeah. nerds, like, we're not a huge demographic, <laughs> but like, we're very loyal. Yeah. There was a therapy show that was really good that huh. got bought by Hulu. Uh, so it's on there now, but. Okay. Anyway, I'll have to sorry look for that. Yeah. So huh. we have a guest today, though, that Hello. we haven't introduced. <laughs> well, how are you guys? Where can everybody oh, yeah. follow you? Yeah. I'm Bjorn RG. You can follow me on all platforms. Bjorn RG Comedy. I'm Nick Scalzone. I'm on Instagram at Nick Scalzone Comedy. Yeah. And I am Eliza Butler, and I'm on platforms as Eliza Isn't Funny. Yeah. Mm hmm. And uh, you're also the co-host of the yes. best comedy show in Portland, hands yeah. down, mm-hmm. uh, Bangers Comedy every Thursday. Absolutely. As are you. <laughs> yeah. As you, are guys, you. you guys got your show into a festival. We You're, did. We did. Yeah. went and did it, just like did the same thing, but in a different building on a time crunch. Um, yes. right? With a paying audience. And right. but we didn't have to pay anybody. Right. <laughs> nice. Paying audience, time crunch. We absolutely blew over our. We had a hundred minutes for our show, and it was probably like what did we do? Two hours. We did like two hours. Yeah, but that's that's showbiz. <laughs> well, so we've been talking about. Let's talk about it on this. It's fine. Yeah. Um, so we got the lineup. It was like what six, people? seven, six or seven. It's like seven comics. Mm. Yeah. I was like, well, we're all doing five minutes, I guess. And we were like, ha 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 ha. No, let's give everyone ten. <laughs> and right. so we did. Which was not a good plan. And everyone went. Well, one person didn't go over their time. Everybody else went over at least the the smallest amount was maybe two minutes. The most amount was was it like a, a really good crowd? Is 10. that what was up or? 
um, I mean, it's fine. <laughs> no, they were a good crowd, but I think everyone was just excited to be there. And and also, Bjorn and I did our intro up top that we do at our other mm-hmm. show, and then we also did sets. So it was a really long show. Yeah, we also we, did but sets. We, we didn't do super long sets. We only no, did. but I did like yeah. two minutes between every comedian because yeah. I got wasted. <laughs> <laughs> and I, then I was on a show the next night at the festival, and everybody on that show got seven minutes, and I was like, that made more sense. Yeah. But it also started half an hour late, so it still mm-hmm. ran long. <laughs> But so like we were we hadn't cleared the room yet and the next show had to start in like five minutes after our show was over. Oh, geez. Like we wrapped it up quick. Well, and I'm not going to say who, but the last person did 20 minutes and they were supposed to do 10. Mm -hmm. So that didn't help. 14, but still long. Yeah. And the person before that did close to like 18 and they were supposed to do 12. And the person before that was supposed to do 10 and they did. Jeez. Yeah, I love that they, they would be like, "Oh, there's my light." Okay, three more jokes, I, real yeah, quick. Yeah. <laughs> like, I just have three more. I got jokes. one minute. Like, I'm gonna do three jokes. I was like, "Am I an asshole for doing <laughs> as much time as I'm booked and like not going over very much?" But no, you're a professional. Yeah, yeah. Here's what I figure: yeah, from your none of the ears. comics, <laughs> m- none of the comics got paid. In fact, some yeah. of the comics paid to be That's on true. the show. Yeah, there were people. So from, you know like, what? New York and it's yeah, fine. it was fine. Like it was a great show. Like not, you know, it was just. Like, we did not know to expect yeah. people to go over, and we should have given people less time. But yeah, I think next time everyone's getting five so this, minutes, this and I expect like everyone's a... going to blow past the light. Yeah. But at least if they, they're supposed to do five and they blow past it, it's probably only going to be like 10. Right? So, you know? festivals like this are like the comedy version of an unpaid internship. Totally. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 I, I mean, th- comedy, until you start actually getting. Sig- the no most of that's paid. like school and the, oh, but then the point. festival's yeah. like an unpaid internship yeah. yeah you pay to be there or well i yeah, mean in this you like one, go all the way out of your way to go do this yeah. bullshit yeah but this yeah. is like local and we didn't have to pay to like enter or anything because mm-hmm. often that's you have to pay to enter comedy festivals um yeah. and you might not get in i um, entered this podcast in the festival too yeah. we did not get in that's why we <laughs> they weren't rejected us yeah. 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 Like, nick scalzone are you kidding <laughs> We, uh, I know that I thought my name. We could have packed. Man, we would have packed out that <laughs> yeah. fourth wall. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, but like that day, the all were all the podcasts and stuff. It was all kind of like science fiction, that kind of stuff. So yeah, bunch really of nerd fun. shit. Yeah, yeah. They my, just my were people. not emotionally ready for no. what we bring. No. Yeah, and they knew true. it. The venue wasn't yeah. big enough. They didn't yeah, have a no. venue big enough to do our podcast. No. Yeah, the Moda Center had something going on. <laughs> yeah, that night. I think was going on. They're like, we can't change a blazer schedule. Yeah, for those. Well, you guys time. watching we actually have a wall <laughs> that separates us from our audience right now so yeah, yeah. there's about yeah. 200 over there yeah so. the studio yeah. audience they paid to be here yeah, yeah. yeah. you have to like enter a lottery like saturday right. night live yeah. you know yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. it's yeah. kind of like buying sneakers yeah yeah. 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 yeah people actually buy bots to get them tickets here <laughs> yeah 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 <laughs> totally yeah oh, no but it was a good time at the festival and it was cool and met some people from out of town and so, you know, nice. did what it Do you feel to like do. festivals are going to continue to be a thing or maybe are they less of a thing? Cuz I I think I they will. Cuz I think I still see like oh here's like there's going to be a festival in Portland in the spring and they're mm-hmm. talking about that and like so I think it is but it's like think about it as like networking. Mm-hmm. You're probably not going to get like a lot not a lot of new fans or anything like that, but if you're meeting other comics from other cities like that's important. It's an opportunity to get a decent tape and yeah, perform. exactly. Yeah, if you're lucky, I've heard some festivals, not not this one, where the tapes were like mm, not good. Did they really? did they yeah. tape most of this festival? No, no, only I did. There, I taped there was our someone show. Someone else taping, but they, I think he was just like hit or miss. Okay, yeah, I mean, he wasn't at it. I uh, show either. I wonder if that has something to do with people going long on yours. Like maybe they were doing well and they were like, this one's on tape. Mm. Maybe that's a good idea. Yeah. So it's your fault, Bjorn. It is. <laughs> yeah, I figured it, it was. I just had to figure out how. You know, and now we got there. And, you know, I was very frustrated with the tape because I used the camera that we use in the studio Mm -hmm. and um, I didn't mess with the settings enough. It's a fucking diva camera, I guess. Mm -hmm. And it was being a bitch. I thought it looked fine. (laughs) I spent a lot of time to make the footage look like that. It was like it was so so the the stage had this giant ha ha words. Mm -hmm. They were like lit up, lit up, very bright. So it, it it's very blown out because i just usually mm, for the so comedy like the shows comics face is kind of in a shadow because of that or what no yeah, cause they're like backlit they're mm. backlit but then there's also stage lights so not only are there it, like it's so much light 
that mm. like the camera just is like oh we're at the beach it, it thinks or whatever so it just really the i don't know i should have spent more time on the settings i didn't i actually set all the settings before they oh. turned on the sign Classic is the mistake yeah. that i made and so it was like i'm sitting there looking at tutorial videos and getting very upset about like because usually what i'll do is i'll get the footage and i'll just make it look it's like I kind of let the footage become what it's going to become. Mm -hmm. It'll be like, I'll just start playing with sliders and I'm like, okay, is this, and just make it look like, I just want everybody to be able to be seen and like people's faces so they don't look sick, you know, like, mm -hmm. and yeah. I'll, I'll try different artistic things. I even tried putting it in black and white, but it was like so blown out. It was just like, ugh. the thing that I'm, I'm going to say this and then we've got to move on to something else. But uh, <laughs> the, the thing that was so frustrating is like I'm watching these videos, these tutorial videos are like, okay, so if your footage is like overblown and I'm like looking at, and they're like, like this and they show you a clip and it looks so good straight out of the camera. And then they're like, see, you just like bring this down a little bit. And then it's like, yeah, now it looks like a movie theater movie, but like yeah, your starting point was like not fucked up like mine was. <laughs> right. <laughs> like, right. Well, and it's interesting too, because I think before like, I don't know. Before 2020, I think it really didn't matter how good your tape looked, because as long as you could hear it, right? Because yeah. you're using tapes to get booked on shows or send to a festival. But like now, everybody wants them for socials, which like I get. So do yeah. I. And so they have to look nice. Well, they, they don't look... have to, but it helps. I think the sound is the most important part. No, I agree. But like, if someone's like, "Oh, I'm gonna put this tape up on TikTok or Instagram," yeah, and it, you know, like it should look kind of nice for that setting. So do people like people now? try to get every tape they can to cut it up for reels yeah yeah that's yeah. kind of what people do yeah yeah well that's like, what i do they're all hoping for like a little crowd work moment that'll make a good 30 seconds mm -hmm. yeah reels. maybe yeah it's, or it's like the best one minute of a joke or whatever mm -hmm. you know i mean this all started from gay dating apps where we had to send 30 second videos Right. Just to even get a shot. So. Wait, is that really a thing? <laughs> 30 second video. Is that where TikTok came from? I yeah. don't know. Well, I guess imagine though if you were on an app and somebody sent you, like, within like this 30 is what seconds, you're going to get, gonna baby. Know. Yeah, and you're like, oh, no. Oh I'm glad that. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah, I mean, there'd be. Gay dating <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I think. Extend. In any kind of dating, a 30 second video, a homemade 30 second video would yeah. result in so many more left swipes yeah, yeah. well isn't like, like doesn't this hinge is... have voice memos now i think oh no they're they're uh grinder has Grindr video does, yeah. video and voice really? yeah that has video oh. does it yeah, just it end is. up being a bunch of versions of that good morning julia guy do you remember that guy no no what was that oh it was this it was this clip that was popular on the internet a while ago uh the the tom segura his podcast like mm. they blew it up for a while mm -hmm. it's just this random guy who like met this girl outside of a gym and then, like, he called himself from her phone, so he got her number. Ugh. And the guy was probably 20 years older than her. Gross. She was, like, 22, and he was, like, old. old yeah, and, yeah. yeah, and this guy just, like, sent her, like, an, a minute-long video. Like, 36 or like, something. Poorly yeah. lit. Bar, bro. <laughs> <laughs> For all like, a poorly lit long. video. Like, <laughs> selfie video of himself in his house. And he's like, good morning, Julia. Oh, my God. <laughs> Meeting Ugh. you yesterday was the highlight of my oh day. My All this Jeez. shit, like, oh, like, like the kind of shit where, like, well, she's gonna die, you yeah. know? Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah it, it was like pretty wild. I, so I'm assuming that's what most people's videos on a dating app see, would end up being, yeah. whether what, they yeah. meant for it to be that yeah. or not. Right. You'd be like, well, this guy is nuts. Yeah. <laughs> what I yeah. what I love about a lot of this stuff is it's just like, so yeah, if that happens in the straight world, it's like gross. Oh my god, creep, get away. Yeah. Happens in the straight in the gay world it's like oh they met at the gym and then he sent a sweet video they, they met like, in the sauna at the gym uh, yeah <laughs> so wait when a 45 place. year old man meets a 20 year old man outside so of a gym when and a then daddy like, uh -huh. you mean a daddy <laughs> you mean a daddy <laughs> good morning steve yeah. meeting you yesterday <laughs> And getting to talk to you. It's just like just the best like, moment of my daddy's day. Daddy's little power bottom I met yesterday. <laughs> I mean, it still feels kind of creepy. I mean, I just sure. feel like creepy is just everything that happens. Every it interaction. Creepy. It is creepy. It is creepy, <laughs> yeah. but it's, I don't know. It's just yeah. funny to me because it's like, I wouldn't think much of it. It's it's one of those things because it's like, it's more dangerous. Yes. Right. That's what it mm -hmm. comes down to is there's like yeah. real danger involved mm. and like. 
I don't know. I've been watching all this like stuff where gay guys are killing people, <laughs> and but like, now I'm like, mm, but I'm like, really glad I didn't see this. Other than Jeffrey Dahmer, Dahmer it, are you yeah. referencing? Well, we Dahmer? watched. Well, you we watched another thing too. There was the, another one. Which yeah, one, which one I thought it was just no, Dahmer. no. The um, someone else was. Well, inspired. I did. I also watched the Gacy tapes, and that's oh, another one. Yeah. And then the other thing was the latest season of um, oh, of uh, American American Horror, Horror Story. Story. Oh, it's yeah. really good, yeah. but it's like. Mm-hmm. It's all gay people in like what, in the eighties in 80s, New 80s. York during the height. Of yeah, the it's 80s. like got Zachary Quinto yeah. and it's really good. It's so good, yeah. but it is just like people like taking these risks and sure. you know. Like, well, I mean, in eighties New York, right? Like that makes sense because it's like if you're afraid everybody's gonna die, so yeah. it's like you know, all right, stand of the world. But like going to parks, <laughs> you oh know, gosh, no. oh. cruising parks. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. I've no. gone, but I've never done anything. If, if I got... Oh, you never killed anybody when you went out <laughs> No, <cruising? laughs> I didn't. Because that's what I that sounds like. Zero like zero I, came, I came close It sounded time. like you were like, I entertained the idea. <laughs> yeah. no. Wait, let me just... I want to say, if I got a video like that, I'd be like, time to lock down my social media and make sure my address mm, is online, yeah. right? But yeah. Like, you're like, oh, let me just go check it out. See what they're doing up here. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I just, I, I get, I get sent like way gnarlier videos uh. all the time, and I never know how to respond because I like want them to still be a fan of my content. <laughs> just be like good lighting. <laughs> like, ooh, wait, because of your TikToks and stuff, you get sent videos really? like that doesn't happen to you guys. No, Fuck no. People don't well, I don't really make content <laughs> on other TikTok? than TikTok. Like, are you talking about not like, on TikTok? Just like Instagram and Twitter. Wait, like because really? of the podcast or because of your stand-up clips? I mean, that's really I. I don't know. They follow. That's where they found me. I think oh <laughs> they're stand-up. Yeah, wow. You get little vignettes of dirty stuff. Yeah, the other day uh, I was going to bed and know? someone sent me a message <laughs> and I like was just like what's this? And it's like a video. And I was like, what's happening? And they were in the shower and doing stuff. Oh um, my just God. Just showing whacking, off. Like, like exfoliating stuff? Oh, no, 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 no. They were just... Um, no, it sounds like they were whacking. No, 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 no. They were sitting on stuff. Oh, oh and geez. I was adjacent. you were right next yes. to me, and I felt really weird, and I don't. And you're just finding out about this now, and I didn't know what to do or <laughs> what how to other do it. secrets Why do you, you just have? Show him? I showed. I could have been like, "Oh my god, babe, look with this." Yeah, you could have enjoyed it together. <laughs> Send me. It's like a benefit of your comedy career. <laughs> 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 it's just like hey, you were really funny. Watch me sit on this. I didn't. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I get I get people sending me pictures of their dicks and stuff sometimes. It's really? Like, I mean, yeah. no one's ever wow. sent me a picture of their dick. Well, now so <laughs> do you, you feel just... wait? I'll be right back. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, like you don't just no, have but one. This is a oh, sympathy yeah. dick. Yeah. I don't want a sympathy app. dick. You, yeah, I, I want a dick picture that's all for me. I want a fresh this one. This is I want to one. go. This has to be a clip. I want oh, one yeah. <laughs> just because they they specifically I'm, saw I'm my Vans and they were like, that guy needs a picture of a car. Yeah, no, <laughs> but, see but you've been getting, so, but you've been getting like weird comments though, right? Like, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. So like, uh, Ooh, we've gotten smooth. some, I love this. <laughs> nice. Yeah, who's yeah. hosting who? I'm professional. <laughs> who's hosting what? <laughs> well, I just felt like a natural I love segue. it. I love this. <laughs> yes. I'll let you host. Um, <laughs> I don't want to. I got uh, well. I got a comment, and then the the size ten podcast got a comment. So first of all, the comment that I got, what did it say? It was like, it was like, oh, so it's this this one that's going viral. Kind of, it's got like right now as of this recording, it's got like twenty six thousand likes or uh, views, which is the most of any of my stuff. It's pretty good. Other than size ten podcast yeah. videos, can you t- obviously. Can, can, do you want to burn like the the premise of the joke? Yeah, to so make one, it make more sense. Oh, okay, well, it's the joke about um, going to Las Vegas with my mom mm-hmm. and her um, her how she uh, she got a little a little tipsy and was just like going up to all these all these women uh, the the showgirls and she kept just being like Bjorn come here this. This isn't doing anything for you at all. And I was just like, no, mom. I'm like, I'm gay. Like, what? Why are we? She's like, well, what about this one? And it was just like, mom, stop. So I joke about that. 
and um what about this one is a hilarious line like you guys are just walking through the pet store <laughs> yeah like, like, <laughs> it's like you're picking out like chandeliers like, right mom, like, that like you're shit. trying to pick out what color parakeet you want like yeah like it's yeah. the specific you want the blue person. one or the green She's getting one. you a christmas sweater <laughs> what about this one yeah it's like mom no i told you i like trucks stop <laughs> showing me sedans <laughs> right, <laughs> like, except there's actual human women right who are like, except they're the people <laughs> who are putting themselves out there yeah. <laughs> yeah, like it's and they'd probably be offended by sedans they yeah. probably want to yeah. hear yeah. Yeah. they'd exactly. probably Sorry. be like what are you insinuating <laughs> like yeah. Maybox or <laughs> yeah yeah maybox and um yeah, it's just sent somebody to therapy <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> somebody <laughs> called me a honda civic <laughs> i'm not a so honda hard. i work so hard on my makeup and my outfit i'm an acura at least <laughs> i have so many aftermarket parts i'm barely oh. <laughs> I know it's polymer, but it's lighter that way. <laughs> Higher performance. Longer. Oh my god, that was so much worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think we, I think we, we dove into the deep end of. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> so that's not how the joke goes, but yeah. it might be uh, wow, after. Yeah, this. yeah you got yeah. some new text. Uh, yeah. But thank so God I, that guy was hateful on I the did, internet. I, yeah, I did that joke, and then made it gayer. And it was, it was a lady. It was a lady. It was a lady. Oh, that made this so a lady made a comment, and then this actually made me just shut Maybe off. Maybe it was a showgirl. Maybe getting it was one of comments. Me, yeah, that's what it was. was. She, it was she was like, with her "Well, parents. your mom probably just wants grandkids. Stop spreading your illness." That was the comment, oh and I was like, "I." I could not stop thinking about it. I sent it to you. Yeah. I sent it to you. I screenshotted it, sent it to you guys, then stopped. Uh, then I turned off notifications for Eliza, comments. What was, and your, I, what was your response when he texted you the comment? I was just like, ugh. I mean, like for me, like the weird comments I get, it's different on different apps. Like on TikTok, people are generally pretty nice. Mm. Um, but like I posted a clip on Instagram of um, it's about a time I had a threesome and it went like relatively not viral but like more views than i normally get mm. on instagram and some the what, what, what kind of numbers are we talking i don't even remember i could probably like, look it up ballpark i don't know several thousand several thousand nice. yeah and it was weird because it like had it was like a long tail where it didn't really do well at first but then like a couple of weeks mm. later same with this one so this yeah. one that's popping right now yeah. i posted like two or three weeks and ago. the algorithms will do that like if, after a week or after two weeks it'll like push again mm -hmm. anyway but so on that one they're just like oh not with you or whatever and i'm like okay like who would have a threesome with you yeah like, exactly and i'm like okay first gross. of all thanks for um the engagement like you're just pushing out to more people so i appreciate it right, also, yeah. like you weren't on the list anyway buddy like why <laughs> i don't like anyway so it's just weird so but it's like mostly like that like it's not really i don't get dick pics or anything like that that, so. remi that reminds me of this this like stupid story i was walking through a crowded bar and there was this woman and I was like, oh, and I bumped into her and I was like, oh, excuse me. And she like looked at me and she was like, um, not interested. <laughs> I was like, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, super gay. Uh, I'm actually just going to try to get to the bathroom, yeah. not get turned down. And you're just like, I feel gross, though. Yeah. Like, but what? No, <laughs> like, I bet she I'm was like, like oh. I could maybe. <laughs> no, I bet she was like, when she saw you, she's like, he's lying. He's not gay. He was or just like, trying to like get out of oh, it. Oh, no, I didn't say that. I just I just was like, what? I was confused yeah. and I walked yeah. away and I was like, wait, this is dumb. Yeah. Why am I so obsessed with like, now I'm like, gonna, I want to like come back and be like, no, excuse me. Yeah. I <laughs> no, am very nice looking. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's like, very rude of you. <laughs> it's like if, if you had the chance to go back in time at any point in time in the history of mankind, <laughs> yeah, yeah. that's the, that's the that's moment. The moment, not that's like to kill moment. Adolf Hitler rooftop, or anything. It's no. like that. Rooftop bar, cafeteria bar in Minneapolis. <laughs> it's this bar that's, I don't know, it's like bougie, but it's a cafeteria. Like that's the whole thing is it looks like that a sounds like Minneapolis. children's or no a school cafeteria i don't know if it's still around this is a pretty cool bar and i don't normally frequent it it was a friend's birthday and that was why i was yeah. there mm -hmm. yeah but getting shut down <laughs> yeah but yeah usually i don't get like hateful comments or once i posted a story that went like it has like a hundred and something thousand views and um uh, it was about there was some stuff where essentially I was making fun of myself as a white woman and like people did not like that. <laughs> yeah. They were very angry and they, you know, told me that my divorce was what I get for, oh, shit. for not Damn. like being loyal to the white race. I'm like, who are you for, oh, for not being God. loyal to like, the white race? It is not that serious. <laughs> oh my 
Oh, God. Boy. I was like, please crawl back under your rock. Like, oh Jeez. my God. But also, thanks for the engagement. <laughs> yeah. 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 But keep the comments. But coming. also, like and subscribe. Exactly. exactly. There's more where that came from. You could be really mad at me. I don't know. So I guess I and I've just been doing it like long enough where it's like it doesn't really get to me. You yeah. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Where, but something like that, I can see where it. Really it well, it didn't. At, at first, I was like, ha. well, and then when it, he said and then it to I was me, like, I just said, congrats. I know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you like leveled uh, up, right? Like, well, I was like, like oh, well, his content's definitely in front of people who would never seek it out yeah, yeah. if this Such lady if some old lady yeah. is seeing like his gay comedy and being like the gays are like, the yeah. gays shouldn't talk yeah. you know Does like he, stop spreading <laughs> oh your God. illness Go, like, oh yeah, yeah. it's Go. like if that lady saw his shit then i'm like, sorry for your gay really son yeah. like that's just go like she should yeah, probably spend you her mean time her like cleaning gay the husband. Out of her twat, She's probably you know? like a pastor's wife. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. You oh, know yeah, the worst. So, or like, somebody I went to high school with. Right. Like, Possibly. Honestly, very like the the thing that comment uh, brought up to me was just like, oh no no, we still have so much for more totally. work to do. Yeah. So yeah. much more and work to do because we're in a bubble here. B, in where you live in a bubble. Yeah. That was well, the one. That yeah, was like, I oh, mean, shit. COVID did a decent amount of work for us, but not yeah, enough. Thank really. God. It was. But, a, yeah. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> God rest their souls. Going, you know, there's <laughs> always time for more mutations, yeah. and I guess. <laughs> oh, they're they're yeah. still going. Yeah, but but like. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, oh. it, it knocked out a lot of old people. Yeah, oh. and I mean, and I think also yeah. just like as a woman on the internet, like I'm used to people just like being randomly yeah. hateful or being like, "Oh, you're fat." Like, yeah, bitch, I know, I have a mirror. Like, not surprised. I still have threesomes, so yeah, you know, I'm not on the internet making fun of people. Mm-hmm. You know, I do that privately yeah. <laughs> in group chats. <laughs> But you know what I mean? So it's like when it happens now, I'm like, whatever. But like when you're not used to it, I mean, especially around something like homophobia, it's like, man, what are oh, I guess doing? for me, though, it just like I, I didn't really think anything of it. And I sent it to you guys like this is hilarious. And then I couldn't stop thinking about yeah. it. Like then it was just mm-hmm. like spiraling where I was just like, Wait, no, but uh, like, you know, like, come on. Like, so then a few days later, we got another comment from the same person. No, oh. from another person oh, I don't know on one of about. our size 10 clips. Mm hmm with david who was on the podcast Mm -hmm. uh uh, what was it what was the paul was the comment it was just a random person who was like that's got to be the gayest shit i've ever seen Mm -hmm. that's all it was not gay and we weren't talking about gay stuff we were not talking about gay stuff i think we were talking about cold showers yeah it's definitely a cold showers do you think it was a compliment they're like that's the gayest shit I've ever seen. And you're well, like, so well, yeah, look at Pornhub. You've got cool, plenty so. of stuff so there. Paul you know? was just like, oh, I'm gonna, and I was like, no, 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 say this. And then what did you end up saying? It was just like, oh, I said, please like and subscribe for more gay comments, <laughs> yeah, content, more, more gay, gay content. content. Yeah, <laughs> I think that's yeah. a that's a good way to shut yeah. him down. Yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I think so. Just because it's yeah. like these are unhappy people mm-hmm. who are whatever it's twisted going in their mind. They're like, I'm gonna go online mm-hmm. and be mean. It's like. Please go outside. I will. I will say cold showers triggered me too. I didn't. I didn't say that they <laughs> were gay. Think- <laughs> I just said they were a terrible idea. A terrible I idea. said no. they were I, the worst. I only started doing cold showers like when we have, wait. Like, you're up. Here. You're on the pro on- cold shower. No, only when it's really hot outside. <laughs> only if it's 120 okay. degrees. Yeah, outside. and only when it's like 103 in my house, like it was last year. Yeah, yeah I was like, oh, the gospel of cold showers. I get. It. But other than that, no. Please boil me like a little lobster. Like, yeah, I need the hottest showers <laughs> I can. Expect. Yeah, I was saying like you're gonna deprive yourself of like five minutes of some shit that feels pretty good yeah five wow no women take longer showers what is it what's the average time Uh, 20 (laughs) but i I just get in there and just like think for a while Mm, you know what i mean so it's i know there's a lot of a lot of women have like speakers in there yeah, I just bring my phone. Oh, and I like, put a uh, podcast on when I was in the shower. Yeah. Oh, I've never done that. Yeah. Really? You totally should. I've drank beer. Oh, yeah. hell yeah. I've drank <laughs> yeah. beer. Or eating peaches, like like really ripe peaches where they make a mess. Eat that in the shower. Mm. One yeah. time. I always would go so and eat those on the when I was When I was in college. Somewhere. Yeah. We were at a party and um, someone was like, yeah, you know, if you take if you drink a beer in the shower, you'll get drunker faster. Mm-hmm. And I was like, yeah, shower bullshit. And I just mm-hmm. grabbed a beer and I just went in the bathroom. <laughs> Just took, I just a, shower? took yeah. a shower at this party. <laughs> Hell yeah. Wait, and then you put like your dirty Tonys back on? Huh? Like your dirty, like you just got dressed in your same clothes? Yeah. Well, then I called out because I didn't, was, there I weren't mean, any. He was, there it was a net, he was a net cleaner person. Yeah, but like, I don't know. The then clothes I, were, the I, clothes stayed constant and Bjorn got cleaner. Yeah, so yeah, I, that's I, an then, then you clean body with dirty underwear. I don't know. I don't know. I just rinsed off, used whatever shampoo was in there. <laughs> shit his pants. No, He's yeah. Fine. I was that fine. time. That time. Yeah. No, not that time. This is this before he had to go gluten free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is before the gluten free thing. Come on. 
<laughs> no, the, the the funniest part or the most interesting part, I think, was then when um, I had to call out to my girlfriend to get me a towel because there wasn't. I didn't think girlfriend? about that part. Wow, that was a long time oh yeah, ago. that was a while ago. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how, gay now, yeah. how gay is that? Yeah. How gay is that? It's the gayest story I've ever heard. <laughs> yeah. Have you heard Kanane's bit about the shower beer? No. Oh, it's so funny. He's like, you could drink wine anytime in any room in your house, but I do it in the bathroom and I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> yeah. It's oh, really yeah. Funny. Yeah. It's on one of, I think maybe his first or second album. There's mm. a great photo on my Instagram, uh, Beyond RG Comedy, <laughs> of me pouring a white claw, just like, because just, just <laughs> it was, I don't even remember what the caption is, but I'm just like pouring it angrily, full arm. But that's the, you can do a long pour in the shower because who cares if you spill a little bit? You can just wash, Fair, you're already yeah. washing yourself. Yeah. But. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully. Have you ever done beer, shower, shower beer? Yeah, yeah. Shower beer, shower cider, yeah. whatever. Yeah. Yeah. That, Nick? That's fun times. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. When you listen to a podcast. You, I just I just feel like Nick's done like a shower, um, not Chardonnay, but that rhymes, shower Chardonnay. Uh <laughs> No, well, like a that's shower. That's a brand we need to develop. Yeah. Shower <laughs> Chardonnay. Yeah, that's, yeah. Like, that's like a can, like a canned wine. A canned wine. Shower yeah. Chardonnay. No, but it's got like the the like the pouch that you put the straw through. <laughs> oh. Yeah, dilute. So it's not even in a can. It's a it's a Capri yeah, Sun. Capri Sun Chardonnay. Chardonnay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. Shower that's a great Chardonnay. Idea. Really is. No, the only thing I've drank in a shower is beers. Okay, not you're not like drinking like a. Uh, a, a scotch a martini no i'm not gonna drink a s- <laughs> i just feel like scotch. nick would be like i'm gonna he just put scotch over the rocks and then like and then let's let's a little water get i in feel there. like scotch on rocks like is a classy beverage and then drinking it in the shower does make you the <laughs> ultimate drunk yeah 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 that's you're like, just like a you real that, you have a problem yeah like. you're a pile of garbage <laughs> if you're drinking if you're drinking fucking hard liquor in the shower <laughs> but what if you were in the bath you were in, a in the sh- bath. Uh, now in the, the bath, bath is a little different. But the bath is red wine, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know. Well, yeah. I don't. Yeah. I don't like red wine. You me don't neither. like? It gives me head weight. Great same. song. Yeah. Yeah. Great <laughs> song. I mean, yeah. Just I have like one. The, yeah. The, yeah. No, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Do you dabble in uh, rosé? No. No. A little too red still. Probably. It was. It's fine. I really. See, I don't really drink. See, white anymore. people don't come after her. She only drinks white wine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, yeah. Or, she or keeps her wine seltzer. pure. Yeah, exactly. She likes exactly. her wine pure. Exactly. <laughs> like all the people serious. who comment on your video. Exactly. <laughs> like, show me your liquor cabinet. Yeah. <laughs> That's Probably whiskey got there, you liar. Variety of colors in that liquor cabinet. <laughs> what about this, Hennessy? Yeah. United these liquor people with their Benetton. integrated yeah. liquor cabinets. Unbelievable. How dare. Oh, How that's dare hilarious. Oh, well, that makes me think. You know, um, we, you and I both listened to a podcast with Gabriel Iglesias on it. Mm -hmm. And he talks in the podcast, he talked about how he really likes being able to bring people together with comedy and how that there were people of like people of color next to guys with Confederate flag tattoos showing at his shows. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, I, you know, whatever. He makes his choices. Like he's very rich. He's done well for himself. But like, I don't. I don't ever want to be like my fans are emboldened to show their confederate flag tattoos of my yeah, shows nah you know like it just ugh. i do feel like that they would love my comedy <laughs> yeah it's the montana in the, like, <laughs> like sometimes when like we've gone to shows like when we went to that show with ollie and i was just like well this is either gonna go amazing right. <laughs> or i'm gonna die a huge death and then one of my jokes <laughs> that uh i i uh i was just like Fuck it. I just <laughs> went right into it. I say the F word two lines into my set. Yeah, and they, the, yeah, and that was in Salem, Oregon, and they laughed too hard. I was not a happy. Too, I don't think I've ever gotten that laughed. big of a laugh. No. But I'll Why? Because it's a good joke? Yeah. They, they shouldn't be laughing at that word. In Portland, you have to be like, it's okay to laugh. It's like, and no, in Salem, you guys they were just like loving it. Like, yeah, in Portland, nobody laughs at that. They laughed at it pretty hard at, uh, in, um, they yeah. no uh in um in uh, hood river oh sure. they hesitated like and they looked around they looked left to right and then yeah, they river. laughed <laughs> hood river's still like kind of they're, they're still yeah. like lefties they're trying to keep up appearances over there <laughs> yeah well i just want to say bjorn if i'm ever at a show with you and you get murdered i will do my best to put up your last joke as a clip on your tiktok thank you <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> thank you i, will you honor you I appreciate that i'll be that. like yeah. he died you'll have, you have to literally get, <laughs> like at least get footage too gay now you get know? footage of him being murdered yeah, yeah. and put well, that on his tiktok <laughs> that might get him like banned so you know yeah. you got to be careful yeah. yeah but footage of yourself getting murdered 
I feel yeah. like you have a case against TikTok. Yeah. Just hashtag like, hey, I was WTF Portland. <laughs> <laughs> We're good to go. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, my oh God. that's crazy. Yes. Let's talk about your shoes. My I'm shoes. I am loving these so Thank far. Thank you. Um, so what did you bring for us today? Uh, I brought my lime green Crocs. Uh, okay. I, and grab them. Grab, grab, grab okay. one or both. I was saying I had had some other shoes picked out and then I spotted these and I was like, these are much they still, funnier. They look very new. Oh, because the are. last, I haven't worn them since I put them, like the one thing that's really nice about Crocs is you can put them in the washing machine with some mm. vinegar oh. and they are nice and fresh. Vinegar? What? Yeah. It's a little vinegar, like not a lot, just like a little bit. Just enough to not a lot, loosen things. Baby girl, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just the tip of vinegar. Yeah, yeah, just the tip um, of vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> the tip of a cap of yeah, uh, exactly. apple cider or just rags? Uh, just rags. <laughs> I have just like a giant jug of vinegar in my laundry room. But Hell yeah. I, at home all the time, I wear Crocs. They are comfortable and um, I have flat feet and I get plantar fasciitis, which is when your heel really hurts and I'm not supposed to wear backless shoes, but they don't cause the problems do so. you do you wear them with the thing up to the front or which one yeah. sport mode sport, sport, sport mode. mode and i do not wear it with sport mode you that don't do too sport confining mode. for me mm. i like them the other way i need to be get in and out quickly because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. i'm at home and i'm like oh i want to like sit on my bed because <laughs> yeah. i'm a hoe <laughs> well, what I, I, like. well, I, I need to be in was, out quickly because i'm a hoe that was implied. <laughs> like, damn girl that was the subtext <laughs> <laughs> I don't got time to put that strap on. I gotta, I gotta get the fuck out of that house. Like, actually, Deal is done. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Or I like put him back on to get him the fuck out of the house. <laughs> I'm done. I like We're that done. the Crocs are the thing that are that's the make or break item in this whole yeah, exactly. in this whole equation. And I've never had a man turn me down when I was wearing Crocs. So <laughs> doing something right. <laughs> they show up. They're like, "You're wearing Crocs," and you're like, "Yep." And they're like. It, does, it doesn't cool. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. It's not what we're here for. I mean, like, I most shoes guys, that you so. would wear in your house, I feel like nobody's walking around their house in stilettos. I think some I wear like are, moccasins. But... Have you yeah. seen? Actually, I still wear my what? Yeezy slides in my house because <gasps> I those are the ones I can oh, no. I can wear when nobody's looking. Yeah, you're gonna <laughs> get canceled. The rest this, of my Yeezys yeah. are stuck on a shelf. They're this yeah. color too. Like <laughs> yeah. they're pretty the similar. Are, yeah, yeah, the Yeezy slides are very much. Yeah. Actually, I highly recommend the Yeezy. And slides. why did I pick lime green? Because yeah. they were the cheapest ones. Yeah, mm. oh, yeah. <laughs> you know that was fine. It's yeah. a great color. Do you yeah. have any of the um the 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 what are they called the though? Gibbets? No. Yeah, I do. I Gibbets. have. Oh, do I have any left? Yes, I have oh, some. You have and some? I'm gonna, and they're going to be gonna a parting some? gift yeah. for yeah. you. They're called yeah. gibbets. Gibbets. Okay. No, um, these are off-brand ones. I asked for for Christmas, and my sister got. They're just like you know on Amazon. There's like yeah. some kind of like stuff that's definitely just from China. Bag. Yeah. Where it's just like. <laughs> Where it's like it kind of looks like Pikachu, like it's just nice. <laughs> it's like you know it's Pikachu, it but you're like, but but like it doesn't break but any he's, laws. He's, he looks a little like, fucked up. It's like if you it's if Pokachu, like, <laughs> Pokachu, Pokachu, <laughs> gonna poke at yeah. you. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> it's like if like you explain Pikachu to like aliens from outer space, like that's what they would come yeah, up like with. They yeah, just, like to a sketch artist, and they got yeah. like kind of close, or like a caricature guy, you know, <laughs> like an AI generated Pikachu. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like it's that's so much better than actual Pikachu. Like that, yeah. and it's just this weird mishmash of stuff. It doesn't. There's just like a couple random letters, like some, and just all these random characters. Nice. Some I didn't even know what they were, and I, I found out. Some I'm like, I've seen it later. And I'm like, what is that? They're like, oh, that's this anime that I like. And I'm like, okay, please stop talking. I don't. I actually don't care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, I, mean, I have the same reaction people, when I hear anime. I'm just like, I, I just don't can't. give a like, fuck, dude. They seem very happy. Anime people. They're like, more anime is out, and I'm happy for them. But but I'm like, fine. I just can't. I'm an no. adult. I I, uh, I always like cartoons. really want to know <laughs> what the porn they look at is. Is it also anime porn? No, that's called hentai. Hentai porn. Thank you. Yeah. I don't want to know that. And I assume that, yes, they do. Dude, there's yeah, this. There, I, I don't know if it's still on. This is like an early Google image thing mm -hmm. that I would always look it up on, on people's computers, not at at on phones because this was pre phones mm -hmm. um there was this you you look up on google don't do it um right now uh, but uh you do safe search don't off it. and it was shitting dick tits and it was like <laughs> hentai porn okay. of this woman with very large boobs and there were like multiple penises coming off of where her nipples should be mm -hmm. and they were pooping mm -hmm. <laughs> like 
that's weird. <laughs> and I was that's... just like, wow. <laughs> and no one ever believed me that it exists. <laughs> yeah. No, that I it existed. You. And you looked up shitting dick tits and yeah, it would be no, I, first I one right at the somebody, top of the list. I believe that someone came up with that, but that's that's definitely a <laughs> well, niche. That's what happens <laughs> after country is decimated by nuclear bombs. Mm. Like, yeah. shit gets weird. <laughs> <laughs> You're <laughs> right. You're right. I think that <laughs> is... <laughs> I mean, yeah. That could be the result of radiation. Yes. Yeah, exactly. So this, was, exactly. this wasn't imagine... Like, could you imagine, imagine going to the doctor's office? this was actually something they saw. Oh, yeah, yeah, this was exactly. a portrait? <laughs> or the, yeah, exactly. the first time you get <laughs> naked with a partner. Yeah. You're yeah. like, I've got to show you something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, don't judge me. Don't judge me. I've got a secret. I've got a shitting dick tits. Oh, my God. Uh, it's supposed to be like a sensitive portrait of the horrors of war. And yeah. just like, ah, I'm going to jerk off to it. <laughs> <laughs> if ever there was like an internet thing, then that yeah. would be it. Just uh, the horrors of war, but it turns out to be like oh, a weird fair. porn thing. Well, I was going to say Bjorn and meat spin. Like, I feel like this meat is like spin. early internet, yeah. like shock. Wait, what's stuff. meat you don't, spin? You didn't know about meat spin? Oh, I knew about meat okay, spin. Okay, you knew about meat spin. A lot of people, I don't Nick remember. Nick doesn't know. I don't. You know, I'm know too what it is? young. I don't it was like things. a Rick, it was like the dirty Rick roll yeah. is what it was. It was okay. around the same time as like you'd get Rick rolled. I thought that rolled. was the two girls, one cup video. <laughs> mm, it was no, before that. It was even before that. No, but people didn't send that as like a Rick roll. You know what a Rick roll is, right? No, I thought it was like you linked to something. I thought then, that's how the two girls one cup video got around. It. No, people just heard about it people and looked like, it I up. I want to see that. Oh, it was just that was okay. in like that e bombs world, like fucked up, like people yeah. dying and stuff. Yeah, videos, mm. videos, and like yeah. like very fucked up, like that like fringe internet, mm. early internet stuff, like the shock jock shock jock era Fa- of the faces of yeah. death. I mean, what okay. was the movie that was out? It was like Saw and like Hostel were popular. Right, it was like, just people like watching the most fucked up shit ever. To Kind yeah. of. See if they can yeah. handle it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. missed that by like a few Tub years. Girls. I think I did. Yeah. I thought Tub I was girls. only two to three years. Tub girl too was late. like, oh, Tub Girl, Lemon Party. <laughs> what happened lemon to party. Tub Girl? Did lemon Party was pretty. It was, was all right. Like in retrospect, Lemon Party was just like some old okay. guys yeah. having a good time. What <laughs> let's was, be honest. Okay, let's describe some of these because <laughs> what, what, I don't know any of these. I don't know any of You don't know Lemon Party? I know. I don't know Lemon Party or Tub Girl. Lemon Party is old guys having a good time. It was just daddies having sex. It was like two gay daddies having sex, right? Yeah, or like more i think it was more like an orgy okay it was like an orgy so but it was all where, why was where, it called lemon yeah party? where do the lemons because their balls look like I lemons yeah, I, no things were they didn't have pissing? to make sense on the internet okay. back then no oh. no it was just gay sex the funny thing is is i i found out about lemon party yeah. at watching um was this uh, the time during cake farts Maybe. I think it was like pre cake farts. Pre cake farts? <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. This is like an internet history so, lesson. Oh my yeah, God. You guys Nick is my super jam. unaware of. Oh my God. Because I, I, I've been like extremely online this since the like, 90s. Yeah, so this I've is been the, here 80s, for the 80s kids teach in the 90s. Yes. 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 Exactly. Okay. So cake farts is when. <laughs> I want to know. Okay, I actually now, don't know cake actually, farts. Eliza, there's a whiteboard down to your right if you want to illustrate. Yeah. Uh, if you want to make this lesson make even more sense. <laughs> All right. So there would be a cake. A cake. A birthday. birthday cake. Okay, birthday candles, cake. Stuff. Some candles. Some lip candles. <laughs> a girl. Okay. Talk into the mic. Oh, then a girl. Yeah. Would sit on it and fart. So that's my favorite artist. And were the candles lit? And so there was like um, a sound when she sat down. I, or you what? know, I don't. I didn't watch it. So they're oh, probably okay. still on. Like, you probably. And would she on fart? OnlyFans. Like, would she first fart onto the candles so she like? Oh uh, no, fart? that probably that would be hilarious. Been, yeah, like I don't think the internet was sophisticated enough to have like multi-level. Oh, multi-step okay. Jokes. That's now they just, did it now. And she would yeah. just walk around slinky and sexy. You like it? Yeah, like, exactly. Come fart on cakes. <laughs> yeah, and then she'd sit in a cake yeah. and just yeah. fart. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so that one kind of like does what it says on the tin. Okay, okay that, that, that was Top pretty. Girl. The okay. way I found out about, hang on, the way I found yeah. out about Lemon Party was yeah. I read in like some, I don't know, like article. <laughs> it was Wikipedia. Of, no, 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 no. I was reading about like. Before Wikipedia. Uh, it was something, some comedy, like someone was like talking about, you know, the state of comedy or something like that. <laughs> and they were talking about 30 Rock had a joke using oh. lemon party as a punchline and they were yes. like it's the dirtiest joke that's ever been told on right. air but they didn't they slid it in there because her name was liz lemon that right. was like the yeah, main so character like a, a, gonna have a lemon party i remember yeah there that, was yeah. like a lemon i don't remember the joke but yeah. it was like a lemon party joke and i was like what the fuck is lemon party and then oh. so i looked it up kind of late like, yeah. like that's yeah. how i and i was like oh this isn't oh this is just a bunch of old dudes okay this is just like the normal porn that right. i watch <laughs> <laughs> 
Like, why they What's call weird it, about this? Why don't they call it like stepdad party? Yeah. Like, <laughs> you're just watching it like, what a snooze fest. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, moving on. Only nine of these fellas? <laughs> right. Yeah. I mean, and also like so many, like the cake farts were like videos, but most of these were just like images. They weren't mm. videos. So then Tub Girl was a girl in a bathtub. She was like on her back, but her ass was all the way up in the air and just like, <laughs> A fountain of diarrhea. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's, oh, that's like a disgusting. That was like the motion. And it's burned into your brain if yes. you saw yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. I'm so glad I did not see that. <laughs> yeah, please don't. No, like, no, like, let my pain and Bjorn's pain, like, save some of you. Yeah, like, no, I'm not going to see Curiosity gets out. burned into your brain yes, forever. Exactly. Oh, and then, like, the classic, though, was Goatsy. You know, Goatsy. Remind me. The oh name sounds familiar, but I. Oh I, my god! How, no, I'm sorry. It. You would again. It would be burned into okay, memory. Okay. Then I didn't so see that one. So this was a gentleman, and it. Well, <laughs> I think. Oh no 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 no! Yeah, no it was. I know what this is. The bottle. Uh yeah yeah but oh, he's got like oh god yes yes his, I remember this one his butthole is very large and <laughs> there is a hand on each side so it's like this gesture so when you see things that are like two hands opening something mm-hmm. everyone's like that's goatsy yeah. um so I mean oh, that was I think that, that was yeah, still yeah. that one is still kind of shocking but then I was like it's a guy it is a guy because you see his balls yeah um you know so but it's very close up so nobody's face you know so it's just like somebody opening a butt yep. yeah. Okay. No, no. And then the, and this was like it, a no, photo that wasn't people this, would send their friends to troll them. No, yes. this was the guy that put the <laughs> bottle in there, and then the bottle breaks. No, that's oh, not. And then he's that. pulling the glass no, no, out no, of no, it. That's not Goatsy. Oh, that's Goatsy a different is one. Just okay. A held open butthole. Yeah. I was like, was there a bottle? I mean, it has been. Let's like, go see this Goatsy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So and, and then it was, I think and then there's two girls, one cup is its own. Yeah, and like two girls. I never watched that one, but I know the premise. Okay. It was like later. Yeah. Like and it was a video, right? Like most of these were. It was the beginning of the end. Is what two <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now no, I us. heard the premise yeah. on that one. Oh, I was man. like, I think I'm good. That yeah, like the, like the early two thousands to mid two thousands, mm-hmm. the internet and oh the God. things that would you, that you would just talk about with your friend. It was and you're just just grossed out. Oh, it's yeah. so gnarly. Yeah. And you had to share that with somebody. You're like, you have to see this, so I'm yes. not alone. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. exactly. Yeah. So then there's then there's uh, cut back all the way up to when people were Rick rolling, which is in the I am. I can't believe Rick Rowling is still a thing. Yeah. But that was yeah. like an I am. Th- Wait, that messenger. started in the 90s? Dude. In the, no, the 2000s. <clears throat> oh. 2000s. Yeah. So like in, on um, on AIM or on on different instant messengers, MSN was the one I was on. I don't yeah. know what you oh, were on. Yeah. No, MSN messenger, them, you're like, like chatting with people mm-hmm. and they're like, whoa, you got to check this out. And you click a link it's and like, it's just like a cool. mystery link. Yeah. And then it would just be like, yeah. and you're like, oh God, you Greg rolled me again. But yeah. there was a dirty one that people would do the same mm. thing with. And it was called Meat Spin. And oh, it yeah. was yeah. a, uh, uh, what's it called where it just loops perfectly? A, a gif that it's just, like a gif yeah. or like a boomerang. Type like, of it's thing. like a boomerang. Yeah but, like, yeah, but it's like a perfect. But it just plays forever. And it was the loudest thing you've ever like sometimes there would be something they would sometimes some of them would be like it's like really quiet like somebody talking really quiet and then it would and so you turn up your volume to try to hear what they're saying (laughs) and then it would just be like you spin me right round baby and it would be that song to this guy um the people these these men uh gentlemen having butt stuff and um this guy with a very large wiener just like spinning his dick as he's getting <laughs> like a helicopter bone like helicopter yeah. <laughs> and it's very impressive it really is I wait mean, this guy like so this guy's he's got both of them very well endowed so this guy is a he's bottoming but he's also spinning yeah, yeah. A and it is a close-up like it's just it's all it's perfect just, loop. it's like yeah. you're right <laughs> Yeah, you, you, it's, it's like, like keep spinning face yeah. to situation. Yeah. <laughs> Still, that's what I would say. Exactly, face to situation. I mean, yeah. it is just cropped in there, and it is just like, and it's so loud, and like it would take over the whole screen. So you'd like try to like click off of it, and you're like, no. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and everybody knows you're looking at meat spin because of the song. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. Like super uh, loud. We got I feel him. like all of these things we've described are gayer than size 10. Which I know, is like right? the gayest thing I've ever seen. Like these are all much gayer. Yes. yes we're delivering sure. and giving that guy more yeah, gay content. This is what he wanted. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. yeah. Exactly. We told him all the videos to look up <laughs> so that the next time yeah, he like, decides oh. to send Bjorn a video of him in the shower whacking off, he's yeah. got something to think about. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like if maybe if on Griner you could expect like a helicopter dick situation, mm-hmm. like that would make it even better. 
And then there was just like the amount of time between when you got the link and you responded like, oh, you got me. Yeah. <laughs> Whereas yeah. it was like, oh, that was too much time, Bjorn. <laughs> <laughs> How long did you watch that video? Like I was showing my girlfriend. <laughs> my girlfriend wanted to see my it. My girlfriend thought it was hilarious. <laughs> and then I had to wash my hands. <laughs> <laughs> Because it would just be like, it, but they they also had all these links where it would just, I mean, people would like have little, they'd create links where it would be like my video or like it would just seem people like it still wasn't do that now. Yeah. Like it Reddit, seemed like it was an in, 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 uh, what, innocent thing. And then you yeah. click yeah. on it and you're like, oh, me, it's been again. Yeah. Or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Like, no, Rick Rolling is still done. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. No, but Rick Rolling was like the clean yeah. version. But like, the, I, the I don't know. Roll. I had yeah. meat. I got meat spin. Should we a bunch. bring meat spin back? <laughs> right. No. Yeah. I don't know. Is On it on your only fan? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but Sorry, I think it extra. was. <laughs> I think it was meatspin.com or something like yeah. that. And yeah. I literally clicked on it one time when someone sent me just like that link. And I was like, what's this? And it's like, okay. Right. But you said that was your sexual awakening. Yeah. That was my awakening. <laughs> no, I don't think it was. I clicked off it pretty quickly. But, <laughs> but it burned in your brain. Like, pretty, yeah. You saw enough loops. You're fine. You got the it's whole there. Story. It's well, there. Thank God Tub Girl wasn't your sexual awakening. I know, oh right? My God. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it could have be been worse. worse. Yeah. Or Lemon Party. Oh. Yeah. 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 Definitely not Lemon Party. <laughs> I was like, oh, I've seen this one. Never mind. Paul's Moving like, is on. that why we always have a bowl of lemons at home? Just nostalgic. <laughs> the Lemon Party. You never even used them. So, when's the last time you wore the, your Crocs? Um, so well, I have, I have multiple pairs of okay. Crocs, so uh, it's been a while because I just washed them and then I've been wearing the other ones, but so, you know, but I do wear them every day. I wear Crocs every day at home. See, they have too much arch for me. That's why I couldn't do them. Oh. My feet start to hurt. I have a, like my weird foot, uh, doesn't like that Your arch goofy foot. part and these, these little things. I don't know. Like my foot just would start to hurt. Yeah, because well, like, I got them they, for the office. They wear mm. down those things. So it's like when you get a new pair, you're like, oh, it's very spiky. You're like, mm. ooh, yeah, it feels like <laughs> it's sanding it's your massage. feet. I wasn't yeah. really a fan Maybe. of them either. Yeah, whenever but, um, I tried his on. Yeah, I got them for the podcast so that like we could talk about them and like because yeah. you got them for your out. office though. I did get them to wear in the office. Yeah. I think these are the same size as the ones I I'm got. I'm sure. Too. I think we have the same size shoes. I, have I mean, I'm I'm size feet. ten, but like I got nines. So like those are like because I I go but, like in women's. I think yeah, eleven in yeah, women's, nine. nine in men's. Yeah, yeah. I go um, the way I do it. If I am gonna wear them, I go. I'm a big foot. I go. Um, not sport mode. Oh. I'm a small foot. I got sport mode. <laughs> I didn't know you had different sizes. Because I have two different no, sizes. His feet, feet are like all and kinds this shit of just, up. Oh. <clears throat> and I think when I got them, um, I I got them a little small just for that reason. Because ah. when it's a slip on type situation, sometimes I got to go. This one's got to be in pain, and the other one just oh, is like yeah, that's living, fair. you know, yeah. his life. Yeah, well, that makes sense. Yeah, <laughs> a, a real Sophie's free. choice. Moment <laughs> a real there. Sophie's yeah. choice. Yeah, moment. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Because I have flat feet, and so they're okay for that. But, but it's like, yeah, everybody, like all the things on your body you have two of are different sizes slightly, but sometimes more. Like <laughs> lots of people with boobs have different size boobs yeah like my two penises are totally different yeah, sizes no. i mean we all know that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it's two penis party dot com <laughs> double meat spin <laughs> <laughs> Wait, was that the culmination of your dream? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just like they're just, just like, fighting. I'm giving it all sword up. fight. You yeah. can do a one-player oh sword my fight. God. Oh. <laughs> or you could. Okay. Uh, no, gotta you gotta finish that shot. Going- no, you gotta double finish double that shot. That's the whole point of like, a comedy podcast. Double penetration with one person. Oh, like, totally. Like, like totally. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a great dream. <laughs> I mean, you could do that like with AIDS, you know, yeah. like yeah. helping objects but yeah, not yeah. one person it's like your dick Lo- can give the shocker <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly i love so it you gotta put the big dick oh in the, badge and the small one yeah in the yeah bottom. yeah <laughs> jesus christ <laughs> thank you, thank you, you told me to keep going <laughs> yeah thank you for we sharing yeah. i appreciate you sharing this don't apologize safe, this is a safe space I'm not apologizing. <laughs> safe space, and it's going to be on the internet forever <laughs> And you defaulted to straight sex, so it's not the gayest it. shit that exactly. guy's ever seen. It's, it's not. Just, they're see, like, we, we cover damn all right, our bases like. here. <laughs> hey, am I the first? Straightest three, shit I've ever seen. Am I the seen. first three-time guest, or have you had other three-time guests? Oh, 
I think you might be you are the, the first yeah. the first Yay, hat trick. Yeah. This is the yeah. first time I actually brought shoes. Yeah, <laughs> last time you forgot bringing shoes. Yeah, because you're I on pandemic. We the idea of shoes. Oh, you don't have your headphones on. I yeah, yeah. noticed that. Oh yeah, oh. you didn't hear the sound effects that Paul's been. No. They're right there. Oh my god. <laughs> Paul's just been sound effecting it up. Wow. Yeah, do the sound effect just one more time okay, for wait, her. Wait, wait. Hold on. Oh, my head oh, is big. Oh, oh I think no, it's, Matt, you, you, it's it's folded over. Take it what off again and the. That unfold one folds. That one. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Oh, I was like, it's so small. You me. got it. It's fine. You're doing great. Oh no! Now the now the, now the now other, other side got <laughs> fucked up the same way. I'm not good at motor skills. Uh, please help. <laughs> I love this so much. <laughs> this is good content. This is this is the best content, especially the audio. Content I can't believe I just it. noticed that too. I'm like, oh, I didn't know. I was looking at y'all with headphones. I'm like, yeah, yeah. Would be cool to have <laughs> nerds them. over here. That's why I'm a stand up though. I'm like, oh I'm the God. one who's important. Oh, I don't need to listen to anyone. They're like, it's oh, the there nice. you go. That works. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Yay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe you've been doing sound effects this whole time. Yeah, I know. I was like, she hasn't even noticed yet. And I'm pulling oh, out all oh the stuff. I did booze. I did yes. Oh, more oh. booze. Another yeah. yeah. Okay. So just like any other show I do. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Get her off the stage. <laughs> Don't be sad. No. So we, uh, we do have another thing that'll lead into some sound effects. Mm-hmm. What what are we doing here? Dude, oh, we're just get getting. Drink, oh, I don't know where you were going. You didn't tell me. <laughs> Trying to. He's, he's like, gonna I'm, click on this link that I just sent him. Like, oh, he's yeah. he's got to go watch some videos <laughs> from the early nineties. Right round, baby, <laughs> right round. <laughs> so we've got to ask you. Yeah. These Crocs. Yes. Do you think these Crocs are going to be pavement princesses or do you think oh, no. you're going to blow the back out of them? No, I've definitely blown the back out of them, but you just put them in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Little known fact, that's recording from my house. No. <laughs> like, it sounds so familiar. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, they look good because they You need been... a new bet. You got to get one of those no. uh, Tempur-Pedics. Oh. No, no I, ha- I got like a nice new fancy bed when you I have a memory right. foam or what you yeah get? i have a purple purple i was gonna yeah. guess is yeah. that purple yeah i used to have lisa mattresses and then i dated someone like briefly before i moved here from chicago mm-hmm. and he had a purple and i was like when i live in a house i'm getting a purple and mm. i did and it's dope so are they house. all memory foam or what are they yeah okay. pretty much you know they come like all rolled up oh they're one then, of them yeah exactly nice. okay. so i love that one and then i have a very tall like headboard from West Elm. So <laughs> there's no new bed for the next 20 years. So yeah, blew my you're good. Well, you're good. Wait, yeah. wait, very tall. We were watching that show White Lotus season two. It's really good. I don't yeah, know. It's right here. Yeah. There's a, there's a bed in the bedroom of one of them. I think I was just high. And when I get high, I don't really pay attention to what's going on in the story. And I just like, look at the decor. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm just like, Ooh, that's pretty. But there was like this headboard that was just like, it was seriously like 14 feet tall. Oh my God. No, it's not that <laughs> you know tall. What I mean? it was just it's like, like, that's excessive. Yeah. Mine's like <laughs> almost six 12. feet tall. <laughs> yeah, 12. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like you have to, you know, have yeah. some decorum once yeah. in a while. <laughs> no, mine's like, I think like six. Well, it's over five foot five because that's how tall I am. But Oh, that's um, awesome. Yeah. I don't have a headboard. Mm. Is that a red flag? Um, no, you have a partner, so no. <laughs> how, as long you, as how are you even but with I have a king, someone? I have a king size bed yeah. and now it's hard to go back. No, I know. I know. Like the bedrooms in my house, like a king size would have been too big. Like Right. No, it's so. too big for our bedroom. It's mostly yeah. bed. It's literally yeah. a bedroom. Like there's just like a room with a bed yeah. and and um a uh what is it that you put your clothes in with drawers? A, a, a dresser? A dresser? That you use to dress a yourself? Chippendale? <laughs> <laughs> Chippendales. Yeah. Uh there's like a dresser but you can't open the drawers all the way kind of uh, yeah. cuz the the bed is taking up all of the real estate. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. That sounds magical. But <laughs> it's I was like, a bedroom. Queen. Yeah. 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 Um, but no, these are, these have definitely been on the pavement. I, they just look clean because they went in the washing machine, but mm. they are. Yeah. The back will be blown out. All right. Give yeah. us a, let's, let's get her a sticker. Hell yeah. yeah hell put yeah. this, <laughs> put this on your car. <laughs> yeah. No, I know. I want you to put a pavement. I want all of our guests to put like our friends put on mm. like just whatever they drive a pavement princess. And yeah. it's like, wait, what? <laughs> no, but if I put this on my car, I'm going to be harassed. <laughs> yeah. You'll, you'll get some of those videos. Bjorn's been getting. Yeah, yeah totally. Exactly. Exactly. Check out what I can do. Yeah, like, good morning, Julie. Yeah. Like, you'll I get a good morning, shit. Julia video yeah, out of that. I, like, awesome. no. I saw, I saw no. your sticker on your car. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And I'm like, not you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Called no. yourself with my phone. Yeah. <laughs> 
but yes, I will. I will. You were, this. <laughs> Nick, you weren't like this. Is why you don't go to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> no, you should go to the gym, but just like don't talk to people. Just like keep mm. the the part of that that the part of that uh, story of like her not being away from her phone for like a second. It's just like I don't know. I play music through my phone. Like I wouldn't notice. Like, that's what I use at the gym. No, I, I think I think what happened according to the story, which actually like. Tom and Christina like found the girl oh, and okay. like talked to her. Yeah. Uh-oh. And what happened is the guy asked for her number and she said no or whatever. And he's like, well, what, how, how about how about if I give you mine? And so then she yeah. handed him the phone. He put his number in and then he called his own number. What a creep. I know. Okay. Okay. Like, I retract no- everything I said. That is, that's some, mm, why that's is there no, no moment? In, there were so many times and he could have stopped, but the, yeah, you yeah. Know what I mean, no, like, the guy was uh, definitely like, yeah, like it was one of those. He things. couldn't have just blocked him. <laughs> yeah. No, like he actually, like she said this had happened years ago. Like the video oh. leaked because her friends thought it was hilarious. I see. And like they ended is. up trolling the guy <laughs> exactly. and getting a couple more videos out of him. It's a whole funny thing. Like if you go to, if you just look up your mom's house, good morning, Julia, yeah. there's endless, endless content of them kind of just ripping this guy. Well, and also the thing <laughs> is like sometimes when people are creepy like that, you don't want to mm-hmm. block them because if they're escalating, you want to know they're escalating. You don't want to like block them and not be able to see it. But yeah, that's, that's it turned smart. out that he didn't yeah. he didn't actually do anything, but it's still yeah. creepy as fuck. Yeah. And it's one of those things where it's just like who? <laughs> yeah, does this ever work for you? Cuz no. Yeah, it's it doesn't. like how how was this ever? How did you record that and then think that was a good idea? He read oh. the game. <clears throat> Oh my and God. was like, <laughs> I don't. No, he didn't because he would have negged her. Can, can I? Can I admit something to you guys? This what? is a safe space, right? Is it? Did I you was, read the game? Do you want to no, get DP too? No, no. <laughs> maybe. <Is that> maybe. <laughs> I was looking through my Amazon wish list of like books I want to read. Yeah, and that book was like in there oh bjorn and no 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 i wanted to know and i was like why the fuck did i put that in there and then i remembered is because that one time i was heading to a comedy show and i got negged on the bus and i didn't know what that was and Ah. nick was like dude you were totally negged Mm -hmm. because i was on the bus and this guy came up to me and he was just like i'm not gay but you are are the most attractive guy uh, for a fat guy you're the hottest uh. i've ever seen and i didn't know what to think yeah <laughs> yeah thank like, you boo for he was that. like i'm not gay but for a fat guy you're the hottest guy i've ever seen oh my God. and you're like dude i'm not even that fat i'll prove it to you <laughs> <laughs> we sent you some pictures and so and then videos. i when i told you that i when i told you you got negged you're yeah. like oh shit i need to learn more about so that i was shit. like trying to look it up and i was just like looking at the origin of it and i was like oh it's this book called so paul what did he say to you when you guys met he was like you know what for a fat guy (laughs) you're pretty good looking (laughs) and i was like god damn it he tore me down but lifted me up at the same time i have to date him so so you're trapped here i'm trapped (laughs) and here i am Cheers to that. Oh, no. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, my God. Oh. Speaking of, this is really good. Those things good. are pretty good, right? Is is there, it's they're more ginger forward Jam- than those. Jameson, ginger and lime. It's a cocktail in a seltzer can. Mm. So, yeah. What can't they put in a seltzer can? It's, it's uh, yeah. It's it's definitely like the ginger in, and lime is doing the heavy lifting in it. And it's nice. actually, it is. Yeah, actually, I think it's, it's more only on, like. What is it like? Five percent alcohol yeah. or something? It's, it's a it's yeah. a nice sugary. It's Six sugary. percent. Yeah. yeah. All sugary. of these. It's just the soda. All of these, yeah. but with booze. I would say to anyone that's going to mm-hmm. try one of these, they're always sweeter. Mm-hmm. Always. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like on the sweet side. Hmm. I, I don't know. know. Like, Whereas it almost needs another shot of the yeah. um, the whiskey. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah I think like, to be a poor one <laughs> in that giant can, it would have to be like three shots. My guess, but then you'd be fucking wasted. Yeah. My, and so people would now, now die. is this a shower drink or a oh. or a bath drink? <clears throat> oh, that's the question. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, so if it was a shower, you drink it out of the can. Yeah. If it's a bath, you pour this shit over the ice. Yeah, I, I feel like if it's bubbly, it's you a go shower on drink. the rocks. Yeah, but if yeah, it's like you're right. Not bubbly. I feel like bubbles is the thing that would differentiate yeah. a shower drink. Yeah. And here's another question: um, Would I? Would this be a better drink for? cake farts or lemon party 
that's the that. Ooh. I mean, it's got lemon lime in party. it. Lemon lemon party. Party. That was my insight. I would compliment well. the lemon. So yeah, you got to get comfortable <laughs> before you're being filmed having an orgy <laughs> with other age appropriate people. Like it, it almost seems tame at this point. It's like they're all the same age. Like right? that's amazing. Just like, like they're, they're all, all seventy. Well, that's, <laughs> they're all clearly <laughs> of age. Like yeah. are yeah. they cart? Like is the they're beginning of the video them showing their IDs? They're like, whoa! I think since then we all learned that like old folks' homes are just like full of STDs. Oh my god! And so we're just like, oh, so they just they just yeah. It was just it was just footage. They just went in after 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 close. Yeah, they 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 went in after hours. Yeah, that's what happens at the Renaissance or whatever. The antibiotic (laughs) risk resistant clap came from old. I know. I did. I read an article about like the clap going through a through an old folks' home. Here's the question: How did it get? out of the old folks home <laughs> you're <laughs> right there was, a, there was a there was somebody was a soldier somebody they wrangled the new n- n- night nurse and oh, <laughs> the, oh the guy night nurse yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that, <laughs> makes okay. yeah, yeah. that makes it okay yeah <laughs> yeah appropriate health care male nurse it was a male nurse, a male nurse. <laughs> <laughs> and the the lady seduced them i can take my teeth out it makes sense oh, <laughs> oh boy all right. Yeah, we're gonna move on from here. Yeah, yeah. we're gonna dark places. <laughs> oh, That's pretty gay, this. though. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> pretty you. Gay content. For more gay content, be sure to follow us. <laughs> Is that what we're just gonna say on this podcast? I love it. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's gonna be our new pretty tagline. Gay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm allowed to say it. They said I could say it. They said I could say it. <laughs> you have your official card. Yeah, I got a gay card. <laughs> um, before we do the thing at the end, um, uh-huh. I love that you're you have a Daria shirt yeah. on. Yeah. Uh, la- La, 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 la. Yeah, six sad world. I very much identified with her as a okay. teenager. So this, this was is... another reference. I'm too old. Oh, yeah. too oh, young for okay. Her. So, okay. Do you know Beavis and Butthead? Oh yeah. Okay. So there was a spinoff of Beavis and Butthead. Oh really? Of a very like a gothy, just mm. negative girl named Daria, and she and her friend, their favorite show is Janine called Garofalo. Six Sad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Janine, Janine Garofalo, Garofalo yeah. voiced her. Yeah. Did she? Yeah. I believe so. Okay. Uh, okay. But like definitely that vibe. Oh, okay. I have a Janine Garofalo thing too in a minute. But, um, and they, their favorite show is called Six Sad World and it was basically like horrible clips of awful mm. things and okay. they would watch it. And Did Beavis like, and Butthead like so. show up in this world? <laughs> um, I think like, maybe like once or something. <laughs> yeah. But she was That's originally, she was like sad. a classmate on like so she was originally on their show she was a classmate she got a spinoff mm-hmm. i didn't realize okay. that it was a spinoff yeah it's yeah. kind of like how i like watched mm-hmm. a lot of fraser and i didn't mm-hmm. realize that was a spinoff oh of cheers of yeah. cheers until yeah. i watched cheers which i was like it was a weird this is a weird reference but it's like i was surprised i mean there's some problematic shit i'm sure especially yeah. now but like i was watching it, i was like all oh, this show is actually pretty fucking good yeah the, yeah. You know, the problematic stuff is like there's alcohol like like um alcoholism is just being like celebrated but in this that's way what it was like in the 80s but it, like, that's what it was nobody like nobody would have thought those were alcoholics they but it's actually like, a pretty decent show i mean like, if you joke writing a bar, is that's decent. how it is now yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but then it was so just like accurate. more common yeah. uh, but janine groffalo i watched her <clears throat> half hour hbo special from like 1995 mm-hmm. and oh my god it was like just so intense just mm-hmm. like stream of consciousness is that was, the one where she has like a music stand um no but okay. she has a notebook with her okay and she keeps like going back that's to her notebook great, where it's like when i see that now like on my show i'm like put your notebook away but like it was cool when she was doing it yeah. you know what i mean like it was a th- oh yeah that was back at the beginning of alt comedy. exactly been, like, yeah 95 yeah 94, yeah it even? was really yeah it was really interesting it was like a cool like artifact and she just like dressed like every super cool girl did like it's so a time capsule hmm. i'll have fun. to check that one out yeah so i think yeah, i saw I the think one i've seen that one i like janine yeah yeah but yeah. uh yeah six at world uh yes. very that's a hilarious like weird like button on this we were talking about all the yeah. up videos we've seen i love yeah. it yeah. all right paul do you got some fits for us today yeah do you guys oh, okay I, <laughs> like i throw it to you you're like no i totally <laughs> forgot to oh yeah we're together. gonna need yeah. one of those Does anyone need a break oh yeah here's this oh yeah let's oh, take a little break you. okay you want to take a break yeah. you guys want to take a quick we're gonna um, take yeah. a potty break yeah take a quick break okay oh did i told did i tell you how clancy said i'm like a chaos magnet did i tell you about that no but pull the mic for okay. if we're gonna right, talk okay. about so um if you're okay with it being in yeah there. yeah yeah so i um clancy has a show on twitch on monday nights called the board castle yeah and when i'm on it like every time i'm on it clancy is always they're like 
oh, this really went off the rails at some point. And I was like, me too. I was like, you say that every time I'm on this show. Cause I've done it like, I don't know, five or six times now. And, and they're like, you're not, you are not that chaotic. The things you say, but like you open the door for other people to be super chaotic. Oh, and I was okay. so proud. I was like, I am a chaos That's magnet. So beautiful. Yeah. It's like I they, felt it's very good seen. chaos. I'm trying yeah, to remember yeah. the comment I got. It was just like, it was something along the lines of like, <laughs> like I'm just, they're like Bjorn, we are so off the rails when you're on. Yeah. <laughs> like there was an episode where like the whole time, well, I don't know what it was, but like I made a comment about how I thought that and we, we talked about it on the podcast too. Actually, we, we brought it to the podcast because I thought <laughs> that um, David Letterman was in this band that he was not. No, I in. think I was there that night. Were you there? I was there. And they yeah. were just like, what the, f-? and then yeah. Ben Harkins was just like, what the hell, Bjorn? Like, yeah, this is yeah, so... yeah. And I was sort of right, but yeah. not. I don't I remember. Was like super wrong, but yeah. like I would, I had, and it's funny because it was actually Paul's dad who he was like was in the band with David Letterman. No, his dad was watching. His, well, his his parents came and stayed with us. Wow, and they were watching YouTube videos, and like he mostly was watching Fox News. And there was a point where like I even texted Paul because I was like at home all day, and I was just like, "Hey, can I tell your dad to shut these off?" And then Paul just blocked Fox News from his <laughs> yeah, from his smart. um. Uh, yeah youtube account so that we couldn't because they weren't even really watching it they were like mostly on their phones and they were just like having it in the background background. and i'm fucking fuming over the right like no we're We're not gonna talk about how great rush limbaugh was like they were like what would rush do in this situation and it's like oh my god he'd he'd yell about it on the radio (laughs) i'm losing my mind and um (laughs) and then thank god they switched to just watching like classic rock videos i don't yeah, know that's better but and that's where you thought david letterman was like in. no he told me he's like hey did you know that's david letterman right there in this band and i was like oh that's very interesting let's file that away and have oh, that yeah. come so up so your dad tricked Bjorn. <laughs> he, and then i was just <laughs> he like set him up. Yep, he's old he's definitely right on everything he's talking about gonna trust him i was like this is a prank that's that's that was later. his time <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, I would I would have been like, oh, huh, that makes and sense. And we were watching the video, and it was like this old video. And I was like, oh, okay, that kind of looks like David Letterman, but yeah. um, uh, it was not. And then I, I misremembered what song it was. He was probably mad because he wanted to listen to the new band with David Letterman and Tucker. Mm. Oh they have God. a duet. <laughs> yeah, they have a oh. duet. <laughs> They're like, trying to get Kanye in on some yeah. verses. Well, they, they, they probably, they probably, probably, they probably Kanye could. with his $200,000 a month child support. <laughs> <laughs> what oh yeah <laughs> yeah how is she living i mean jesus that's barely enough for her to scrape by. like yeah what yeah. is she gonna do well, yeah that's is, like one like, or two days she's getting her. a part-time job at marshall's no <laughs> so the thing is though it's like that has to be done in divorces like yeah. it just is like yeah, in different states have like a f- formula of like this mm-hmm. is if you have this many children this is how much percentage you get mm-hmm. okay so i'm sure it's something like that i'm sure you know she doesn't need it, but the law yeah, the they law. probably also used his previous net worth figure. Yeah, exactly. That was my thought. I was like, was that before or after? Oh, the job? I know. She's like, oh, thank God, I got that before the <laughs> exactly like, before the Adidas the deal fell apart. Yeah, Chris, like Chris. Good thing we're going yeah. with taxable yeah. income from last year. Yeah. Like, Chris, yeah. We're using last year's W two in court. This is for us. Chris Jenner is like Woo. suppressing the news. She's like suppressing the Adidas stuff until the divorce is signed. Oh my god. I mean. They probably yeah. hopefully yeah, it's, it's all probably the way through. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, are anyway, you guys ready? I'm for? ready some, for some fits. You'll okay. You didn't have the whiteboard. So last week. Um, now it's time for uh, hashtag FWT hashtag uh, wait F- uh, WTF. DTF. So we're gonna look at some fits. <laughs> so it's either fuck with this or what the fuck. Okay. Okay. And it's sort of like it's not like necessarily would you wear this sure that this part I, we just didn't have the whiteboards last time mm. yeah but i remember so this part. i'm gonna show some um some fits from online okay and then you're gonna take a look at it and you're gonna write down whether you would fwt fuck with that or what the fuck wtf okay and we're gonna talk about the look and describe the look to our non-visual um listeners who are just listening so awesome um all right we'll start if you guys can close your eyes because unfortunately oh. we've got tvs everywhere so you can see it i'll <laughs> let you know oh no, no when we are ready for that this is when i was in church and i would get, pretend to pray I'm like definitely my eyes are closed <laughs> my eyes are closed Let's see you're looking at everybody else with their eyes closed yeah like weirdos <laughs> uh, 
hold up one second. Almost there. I am playing along this time. I was definitely in a church recently, and I was doing that Why still. Even, oh, so I, I haven't. Even church. Yeah, yeah. Wait, why'd you go to church? Yeah. All right. Oh. So we're going to do holiday edition because it okay, is now the holidays. My... You can open your eyes. Okay. Hell yeah. Uh, so this is a, a hot. So I did just, Ooh. I just hashtag the holiday drip. And this is one that came up from uh, Mr. Veganair uh, mm. from December of 2020. So a couple years old. Uh, but wonder uh, if he's vegan. Yeah. <laughs> I, that's a good. That's a good question. That's well, a good question. Shoes or leather. So let's start with uh, let's start with Bjorn. If you can describe the look, and uh, we'll go from there. All right. So we're gonna go uh, bottom up because that's what I like. <laughs> <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> that was really gay. <laughs> For more gay content. For more gay content, please <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> Our listeners are like, this joke is so fucking. Stop it. Too bad. All right. Uh, bottom up. We're going. Um, so he's got two different jordan fives on no that was one pair that was one uh, pair that was okay. Old, yeah okay that was a pair okay. that they sold one was yellow one was red i forget why all right so it was pretty stupid but that's a pair okay, okay. i thought he was just flexing that he's got two pairs i've thought about doing this <laughs> i don't think <laughs> it would be that much of a that... flex because neither of those would have been a hype pair <laughs> yeah, <neither laughs> those. well i've got the the toros those are those are decently hyped um so yeah, I think yours are better than those, though. Oh, okay, because people wanted two of the same, not this. Yeah, weird people didn't want coat. mismatched shoes. Sure. <laughs> people did, and not this much. I like when they mismatch, where they, it's just like they're complementing each other, mm-hmm, but they're not mm-hmm. like maybe they're not exact, but it's just like oh, you've got like a yellow swoosh and then the red swoosh on the other, like maybe. But this is like straight up, full on yellow shoe, full on red shoe, um, and then black uh skinny jeans some kind of belt i don't know what it is it's got a big old belt buckle on it it looks like a v on it so it could be a louis vuitton or a valentino yeah oh, and then the comment says love the louis vuitton louis so. vuitton so maybe um and then a peacoat white shirt and a uh red scarf and then we've got like some grandma glasses and a black beanie and some sort of watch and there's a on his scarf. It's a teddy bear with a Santa outfit on. It's and a it's polo. polo. Okay, so polo. Mm. Um. So who's gonna take it away? Ah. Uh, so I, write down what you think of oh, it. I see. Ah, write down what you think. Is it WTF or is this a FTW? Mm. Um. And this is all in good fun. We are none of us are super fashionable no. at the least. So yeah, look what our I'm wearing. I'm wearing an really oh matter. yeah. Um, Kool Aid Man um, jersey. Yeah, it was like nicely made though. It's like embroidery and stuff. Yeah, it's got and then it says "Oh yeah" on the back. We haven't even mentioned the, the ridiculous shirt. <laughs> yeah, it's that I'm got wearing. the Kool Aid Man over here it's, with a wad a, of cash in his hands. And then he's got a gold tooth on it. Like we saw this at the mall, and I was like, "Well, I'm buying that. Don't care how much it costs." <laughs> hundred dollars later, I that was a hundred bucks. Fly as fuck, yeah, dude. But Holy that's like shit. a pretty like normal cost for a jersey, right? For like a jersey. Wait, is that what a jersey costs? A hundred dollars? More. I, I paid a hundred dollars for my Dame jersey at the employee store. Most of it licensing Jeez. is really expensive. Yeah, yeah, but this isn't. Yeah, this is. I mean, and it's Kool Aid. So. Oh, and it's camouflage. <laughs> it's like red camouflage. Yeah, it's like red camo. Um, mm. it, this is a DGK, which it stands for Dirty Ghetto Kids. Mm. I, don't I think thought it was like genuine <laughs> merch. I thought it was like UGK. That's a little but problematic. I don't yeah, know what the D- <laughs> Dirty ghetto kids is. You're not allowed to say that. <laughs> but well, it's the name of the brand. Acronym. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's just explaining it. <laughs> He's not they, I don't know. It. I didn't know they updated the it. That's what it used to stand for. Maybe no. it stands for something no, sure else now. For. <laughs> anyway, what is, are we supposed to? What is your answer, Bjorn? Okay, my answer is what the fuck. Um... <laughs> I just first of all I'd be down for it if it was all red shoes I don't like the yellow shoe it doesn't make any sense um I like the pea coat I mean there's a lot of redeeming qualities to this outfit but like the yellow shoe is just like dude did you just like leave the house like were you in a hurry like it doesn't it doesn't feel deliberate to me and why yellow like it doesn't make any sense with the rest of the it's sort of it's supposed to be a Christmas fit I mean, I fuck with that scarf. I didn't realize how expensive scarves were. Mm-hmm. How much were those? We were in the, I was going to get a scarf for my mom for her birthday. 
uh, Pendleton. What was oh, it? Like, those are really like two hundred dollars. I was like, yeah. oh, my mom might like but, the scarf. And I was like, two? No, Pendleton, we're not buying a yeah. piece. Yeah, of I mean, it's fucking a, fabric. It's expensive. It's made out of wool. I yeah, could Pendleton buy an American sheep, dude. Yo, yeah. I could buy one of their blankets for that much and cut it that's into fair. five <laughs> scarves. Yeah. You know what that's you could true. do? Is you could learn how to knit, mm-hmm. and you could knit your mom a nice. I could teach you how to knit. It's pretty two hundred dollars for a scarf yeah. is just too much, and I bet you that polo is two hundred dollars. Yeah. Oh yeah. But yeah, I guess if you knitted a scarf, then you would know why they cost a lot, because it takes mm-hmm. quite a while. But I bet knitting a sweater is even is more than two hundred dollars. Yeah. Oh yeah. If I yeah. knitted a sweater, I'd be selling it for like two grand. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know yeah. you would. <laughs> and on um, and the yarn cost, right? Because that's expensive too. <laughs> yeah. D- Labor and two thousand and two dollars. <laughs> 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 no, I when I knit, I would I always use like nice wool and stuff. Oh no, you're right. So it'd be like twenty one hundred. So yeah. yeah, this is like, a what the fuck. I'm a not, sweater takes a lot of yarn. I'm not yeah. I'm not feeling this look. I'm just I'm, I mean yeah. the shoes the yellow shoe the one yellow shoe is where it lost me. Yeah. Other than mm-hmm. that, I do like it, but the one yellow shoe is just kind of like what the fuck are you? No, mm-hmm. nope. Right. Eliza. Yeah, I'm also WTF. I think for <laughs> I think for those same reasons, like it's like that line from Clueless, like it's like a Picasso, like it looks cool from afar, but like up close, you're like, what is going on? You know, mm-hmm. that's not the line. It's a good it's line. Monet. Yeah, Monet. It's Monet. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god, I should know that. Thank you. Oh that's man. the somewhere my best thing friend. that's ever happened on yeah. this podcast. Yeah. <laughs> what, somewhere no, my best corrected on a Clueless reference. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. I should know better. <laughs> By um, a man. So like from afar, it looks nice, but like I do not fuck with the scarf i don't like the teddy bear i get his polo whatever i just i don't i think it's just a little corny yeah. and yeah the shoes are confusing like it helps to know that you know that they were supposed to be <laughs> that way sold that way yeah which is you know or I mean, they like it almost makes mustard. it worse that they did that he did that on purpose yeah yeah and he was like he went out of his way to acquire that pair of shoes exactly exactly i forget why that pair of shoes was a thing it's probably it probably was commemorating some shit yeah <laughs> probably. But like, it was like, a, it was yeah. like the time the, the chicago bulls played the the whatever the yellow the, the team great is. mustard and ketchup is <laughs> yeah. yeah this was like 1821 yeah, yeah. mcdonald's uh, and burger king yeah. played in a 1999 game? jordan played a game in a white he had a white t-shirt and he had a <laughs> hot dog and it spilled all of, this shit is real like no, we're making fun of it but it's always like yeah, this weird like commemorative Michael jordan <laughs> i was like he was are he they forgot because he ate too many for pizzas. charity with ronald mcdonald yeah, yeah. see when you said commemorative <laughs> when you said commemorative i was like are they for 9 11 like <laughs> no, i didn't no. realize there would be a whole war no that would mustard be mustard on his white they're shirt. always like there really there really is like uh, i swear to god isn't there a sick game jordan like the flu game the flu game yeah but they're called that because he just happened to be wearing those when he played the flu is game. that the one where he ordered like five pizzas ate them all and then was like no super he sick? ordered a pizza no, a late at night in uh in salt lake city in i think it was whenever the 12s were the, the ones he was playing yeah. 96 or 97 whenever the finals were in salt lake against the utah jazz and uh yeah he got really really sick and but he still played and claimed he had the flu he just had food poisoning <laughs> but he claimed he had the flu and so they called it the flu game and he was wearing the black and red 12s okay and so that's why those the... are called the flu game 12s they don't they so, they didn't remake no, those because of that, that. the flu game there's They're like some with like some vomit because. on them it's just on the right shoe because that's the one he threw up on no that's not that's not a thing <laughs> yeah but they yeah. are called the flu games yeah <laughs> but like yeah the guy clearly has like a good sense of style like he putting stuff together i just don't like some of the details i do like the the this this new like like um old person glasses thing that's happening mm-hmm. i don't know why i like it and I, I think I, the Migos brought that in, didn't oh, they? Oh, yeah. They made that shit popular. Well, no, 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 no. What about what's uh, E40, I feel like, did that? Oh, the E40. Shades. E40 definitely right? had the old man glasses for you know a while. What? Can you just, just, just humor us? Are they the ones that have like the slats on them? No. The stunner shades were just like old. It was just like, we're all, it's like gangsters getting old. Uh, like, yeah, E40 stunner shades. Um, just images. <laughs> He did it on the uh, like these right here. Look oh, at those oh, old man yeah, glasses. Yeah. Okay, I get it. Yeah, he was wearing. He like would wear glasses. those like reading glasses. Yeah, <laughs> like go go up to the top. Uh, go uh, tell me when he was totally wearing them uh, on the cover okay. of his album. Like yeah, like that shit. <laughs> <laughs> like Imagine yeah, yeah, right there, that one. Right. Imagine being cover. so cool that you could wear something uh, like goofy like that, and everyone's like, "Oh my god, I need." See, it. that's that's the thing. 
Yeah. That's that is the, fashion. That is fashion. That is fashion right there. Yeah. That's why Yeezy could just like shit on a pair of shoes and everyone would love them. Or be them. like, I want shoes. I want to <laughs> fuck. We all read the article, right? Like, <laughs> I, gen- I genuinely yep. want to fuck those shoes. Like, that. he wouldn't stop talking about fucking the shoes. <laughs> and it's like, I didn't know Quentin Tarantino was like the least offensive foot guy. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I did not see, know it could get like worse. That's the funniest shit I've ever heard. Yeah, no, that hilarious. didn't make me like the shoes less. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Nick was like, hmm. Yeah, I, I was like, we should, fuck them we should check on his Yeezy. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, they're, yeah, they're like, my, my oh, days. those are very, cl- they're Way awfully big, clean. <laughs> Nick's like, did you know you can throw your 350s in the wash too? <laughs> With some Just bleach? stains come right out of them. <laughs> you can't I mean, even tell what kind of shit you put in them. <laughs> I mean, all three of mine are kind of a lighter color. Right, so. <laughs> You're planning ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Paul's like, can I please get to the next slide? Yes, yes you can, yes. sir. Well, wait, no, does Nick not need to go? Or no. You we, take turns and I'll go. take turns. Okay, right but, but, I will, but Paul, what is I your thoughts? Yeah. What um, are your thoughts? I collectively, it goes one way, but I'm going to look at this a little different from you guys. Okay. Right? And I'm going to go with a fuck with that. Hmm. Here's why. The piece is all together, uh, different, separately. Great. I like the beanie. I like the glasses. It's a great pea coat. The belt's awesome. The pants awesome. Yes. Um, if we just changed that one shoe to one of the other yeah. colors, yeah. it would have been an okay look. Totally. But I see where he was going with that, and I'm okay with it. And I don't know. I think, I think people with two colors on them are the most beautiful people in the world because I'm biracial. <laughs> so this is speaking to me. Okay. okay. All right. I well, okay. I, I know. So, I'm, I'm really reaching there. I'm really so, reaching. <laughs> I'm really reaching. You're like, you're live like, your truth, Paul. Thank you. are like, so the red is like. And I really want a hot dog right now. <laughs> yeah. So this is just like perfect for me. You can't have one of those All right. You ready for the next look? I just, what, last thing I want to say about this look, I had a co- if we were at dinner, I'd compliment him on it, if that makes sense. But you compliment people on their shoes all the time. No, on the look. Okay. I like the look up into the no, shoes. That's where yeah, it loses yeah. me. Okay. Okay. Do Ready for the next eyes again? Yep. Yes. Close okay. the eyes. And going to continue with the Christmas theme. Go ahead and open Ooh. up. And this is ah. look number two. So this is oh, Cariology. Um, apparently, he, he's at the North Pole. He's at the North Pole. And it looks pretty damn nice for the North Pole. I'm not going to lie. And I, I haven't flipped. I think he here. might be. He might. But be there, there's a look that. at his shoes. What's he got? What are those? I'm they kind of sure. just look like Adidas sneakers or, like, or Sperry's or something. Or so there's another. Or are they like a high fashion? They're probably Adidas a high fashion. Yeah. yeah. They're probably like a thousand bucks. Yeah, like yeah. <clears throat> maybe common goods. Mm, or common like projects. Common projects. Yeah. Something but there, like there's that. A, there's another look uh, of him. So he's performing. So this mm-hmm. is a performance look mm-hmm. in a way. Mm-hmm. But. Uh, you guys want to write down your answers? And then, uh, Eliza, let's start with you. If you can describe the look to oh, our okay. listeners. Yeah. Um. So he is wearing like a cap. Like what What kind of cap is that? Would you say? It's like, like a what? baseball just cap. Like a, yeah, yeah just baseball like a baseball cap. Baseball hat. Like kind of like a... It's like a beige- regular canvas. Yeah, regular like canvas hat. Like hat. Which, Yeah. And he's got... In this picture, he's got some sunglasses on with like amber lenses. He has a green, like a kelly green sweater or maybe not quite kelly yeah green. like a button neck like a yeah, yeah a sweater like, with like a polo shirt neck yeah exactly and there's like um, a white collar poking out and then he's wearing these plaid red mostly red and yeah, like green and red white and plaid. black lumberjack basically yeah exactly like a, like a tartan almost yeah exactly pajama pants and the white <laughs> shoes that yeah look kind of just like general like mm. i don't know just like of sneakers but clean yeah sneakers yeah they look cool they look like an adidas sam smith but more expensive yeah exactly and then he's got in one picture this like little messenger bag that's like um crossbody looks like coach yeah looks like a coach bag <laughs> so yeah like my wallet i have a i have a coach wallet because yeah. i'm apparently an asian grandmother <laughs> so fancy <Bjorn. laughs> yeah. Yeah. all right let's okay. start with eliza would you right. oh my answer is <laughs> down to five <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he's he's an attractive man. Like, I don't know. <laughs> What's a nice outfit? Is that, oh, yeah. Yeah. Is that what you're gonna comment, Paul? Weird DTF. <laughs> I, I thought it was a tag. I, I thought it was a mistake. Ever so like, no, she's so. <laughs> <laughs> I know how the game works. Believe me. 
No, it's a very nice outfit. I like how it's all put together. Like it's like lots of like different colors and like patterns, but like yeah. it works. Oh man. Um. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, that was amazing. No. <laughs> I wonder if Nick has the same answer. <laughs> oh, I, I did say FWT. <laughs> yeah. I would also fuck this man. <laughs> No, more I gay like content. More gay content. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're making the gayest no. episode ever. Oh my god! Just every guy up there was just like, "Yeah, I'd suck that guy's cock." Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see the outline in those pants. So I fuck that. I, <laughs> yeah. No, I Fear like his outfit. DTS. It's a cool outfit. Yeah, I, I yeah. like that. It's like woodsman type of colors. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. like a woodsy. It's my favorite low key Christmas. It's, it's a little yeah. bit of Christmas, Christmas, but like it's. It could just pass for like, you know, hunting camp. Yeah, or like a fall outfit. Like, you know, yeah. not really. Like it's the color palette of hunting yeah. camp, yeah. but like you're not going to wear those pants. Yeah. But like, they're, it's cool. I think it's a good outfit. It's like a, it's fun and Christmassy, but in like a low key way. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yes. Yeah. And his shoes are in the same color. Yes. Yeah. They that's, match each other. The shoes. That's, the that's shoes I like the way her. his package is wrapped. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I am in a hundred percent agreement. I also FWT fuck with that look. That's a great look. It's really sharp, um, and it, it's Christmas to me. It's totally holiday. Um, I love green and red and the tartan pants, and and also D T. <laughs> like, uh, on that, one. On that one. So I opened up a whole new like so level gonna, for you. I want to leave them a message. Yeah, we always leave messages. The ETF. If- no. <laughs> Sick look. Yeah, nice. that's fun. There that's really go. thoughtful. So he's a rapper? Who is it? Uh, yeah. Choreology? Uh, let's find out. Oh, he's got a, a he's got a holiday album. Oh. And see, here's the thing. I've always, I actually was thinking about this the other day. I was like, okay, like I can't do it as my first comedy special. <laughs> Or maybe that's how I do it. Yeah, I think I think a holiday album. Like I know, oh my I'm God, sure. That's so fun. Yeah, I, like no, uh, the only comedian I feel like that's done it is like one of those like puppet ones. Mm-hmm. I feel like Jeff Dunham's done it, <sighs> but like who else has done a Christmas comedy album? No, maybe that's like the, maybe like the redneck comedians or whatever. No, probably one of the Christian comics. Or the, all of oh, the Christmas yeah. Chris, yeah. Christian comics. But like, like I was just like, like damn. good comics happen. Because I was listening, I was listening to that Sia <laughs> album. It's fucking mm. fire, and mm. I'm just like, fuck yeah, Sia. Just be like, I'm gonna do a goddamn Christmas album. Fuck you, Mariah. It worked for Mariah. <laughs> like, I was gonna yeah. say, like, I mean, yeah, it's like this. It's kind of like this bullshit selling out thing. But it's just like, but if you did it on your own accord, like. I don't know. I think there's something kind of rad about like doing a Christmas yeah. album. Yeah. <laughs> like I have like a 20 hour Spotify playlist of like non-traditional <laughs> Christmas music where it sounds like the Sia would fit. And his puppies, puppies are forever on there because it should um, be. No, but Dominic just... the Christmas donkey is. <laughs> okay. <sighs> It's a Pup- terrifying song. <laughs> Puppies are forever is like I was my favorite. Say, that song sounds like album. another one of those videos I missed out on. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> this is just a terrifying Italian donkey making like honking noises. Oh hell yeah! Yeah. But it still sounds like the yeah, description. It, yeah, of yeah, it totally could be it's somewhere okay. in Ebon's world. Sounds like you had omitted one detail, and that was the yeah. rest of the story. <laughs> All right, let's get to this <laughs> next party part two. We're going so long. Yeah. Okay, okay, close, close your eyes. eyes. Close your eyes. Okay. Close okay. Your eyes. And uh, open them. In, in the spirit of the holidays, ugly sweaters and different versions of uh, ugly sweaters. We have kosher ham from San Jose, California. Um, and Bjorn, let's have you describe the look and write down your answers. And Most we'll describe the, the, the heavy lifting is being done by the sweater, which is a back to the present. It's like a Christmas. Presents. Oh, back to the presents. And then there's a, and then there's a, um, DeLorean. There it is. Nailed it. <laughs> I was like, Santa in a DeLorean. It's like a DeLorean with a bow on it. Kind of mm. like a, um, a Lexus commercial. Um, I've always wanted to do that for somebody in my life, but you know what? You can I, just buy the bow. You can just buy the bow <laughs> just and just, just put it on their, their car. Yeah. <laughs> just, just, wa- yeah. just wash their car. Like, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You yeah. give I, me a giant bow for yeah. my. You're like, this is not mean I'm making the payments, but <laughs> <laughs> looks cool. 
You know that Mitsubishi you already <laughs> <Yeah>. have? <laughs> well, now it's harder to get it. Like, babe. <laughs> Did you Merry crack Christmas. the windshield more? <laughs> Babe, did you fix the windshield? Oh, you didn't. Okay, you just got a bow. Okay, perfect. You don't have to describe my Subaru. <laughs> so what, what? What else is? What else is? He's uh, wearing a he backwards, wearing. um, tr- just regular hat. It's not a trucker hat. Mm-hmm. Just regular hat. Black pants. Um, but really, it's the. It's mostly the sweater, mm-hmm. and um, yeah, it's mostly the back to the presents sweater. And then he's looking off camera for some reason, sitting on some yellow stairs. Mm-hmm. Uh, there are yellow arms, and there's some arrows but is is back to the future a christmas movie no i think it's more just like a reference that you would get Mm -hmm. it's not like one of those like it's kind of low-key christmas no that's like home alone or die hard yeah yeah Yeah, die hard is the one it's like i feel like a die hard reference would be better but that's Mm. just my own opinion Mm -hmm. there Um, probably are those two but this one may i feel like they do lots of those whimsical I've got yeah, a yeah. goofy Wu Tang one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. At some point, clothes got like whimsical, which mm-hmm. I love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I definitely would have been called gay for wearing for that, this but you in know middle what? school. <laughs> yeah, no, they're all dressing like little pilgrims. Yeah. Like, oh my god, have some fun wearing mom jeans. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> all right, Bjorn, me. What is it? All right, this is a, <laughs> this is a fuck with that. Uh, uh, even though I was talking a little bit of shit, it's mm-hmm. just kind of like a basic outfit. I'm, mm-hmm. I, 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 I've really liked the ugly sweater movement. <laughs> I fully support it in any capacity and a reference to a uh, flux capacitor or whatever. You know what? I'm into it. It's got a cool Toyota in that movie. Um, Paul's dream truck mm-hmm. given away. Spoiler mm-hmm. alert. Mm-hmm. I found out about that on our first date. Mm-hmm. Hey, Bjorn, I feel like you just like this guy. Cause he looks like the guy who wrote the game. <laughs> yeah it looks like the cover of the back of the game so i'm like this guy looks like he has some answers <laughs> oh my god yeah all right eliza um, what do you think i also fuck with this Ooh. yeah like that's like a lot of sweater but he's like pulling it off you know mm-hmm. what i mean like and he was wise right the pants are really neutral the hat's really neutral yep like right and with your ugly christmas sweater like you want it to like take all the attention um i mean i think you're right it's like you know what is this reference but i agree with nick like it's just like well everybody knows back to the future like let's make a sweater about it you know it's a conversation starter yeah you know? and, and the the kind of the racing the delorean racing stripes or whatever that are on the side i don't know it's interesting it makes the shape look a little different of the sleeve but it's not mm-hmm. but it looks a little different which is kind of cool so yeah i'm i'm down with that nice. okay paul what you oh, got this is really easy yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah of this is a fuck with that. I mean, uh, it's a it's a back to the presents rather than back to the future, and they did a spin on it, so it's about Christmas presents. Mm-hmm. It. I, I just love it. it's simple, but it's fun wordplay, and I really like it. And I love I love a Delorean moment. So mm-hmm. yeah, this is a fuck with that. And I like the the yellow in the back. I like this. I, I like the overall picture. So, mm-hmm. um, so kosher ham. We're gonna have to leave you a message. Yeah. Hashtag sure am. fuck with that. That's fun. I, I, because we're talking, we never talk about DeLoreans on this podcast. Is that a rule? I, or? No. no I want to know, come up. Nick. Do you think that it's? Do you think it's cool or dumb that the they DeLorean? only had one color? I think it's kind of neat because it's stainless steel. I think it's fucking rad. I've always yeah. thought that. I'm the like, DeLorean you know cool that it's a car. DeLorean. From everything I've ever heard, they're a real pile of garbage. Like they're, <laughs> they're like, unreliable and slow as fuck. Yeah. But they're cool. Yes. Like they're they're cool because they're unique. And they were nothing but somebody just taking big swings. Yeah. Like some guy made cars and took big swings and they, they were bad cars. He was just but like, they were cool. I can't fucking miss. And then he missed. He missed in the, biggest the whole way. thing. They but you were, have to like respect that he just went all yeah, in. I, yeah, I respect the send on the DeLorean. It's a ridiculous car. It has butterfly doors, right? Is that what they are? Like, yeah. they're gull wing. Gull wing yeah. doors. Gull wing doors. They're not the butterfly doors. They're the gull wing doors like the old the SLS. Doors. Or like like the Mercedes mm-hmm. SLS, yeah. Or the SL three hundred was that the one from way back in the day? I think so. From like the fifties, that's a cool car. Anyway, yeah. Anything you hinge the doors up on the roof. Can you look up what that like, car is? I don't know what it is. There's no way it's not going to be SLS. Cool. Just look up Gullwing Mercedes, and you'll find it. Yeah. I yeah. I, Hell like, yeah, oh, dude. Shit. That's three yeah, hundred SL. That's got to have been a Bond class. car the, at some point. Right? Yeah. No, I don't. Ball? It was no. pre Bond. Bond. I don't think the three hundred SL was ever in Bond. That, that is cool. Is but those things are worth 
an outlandish amount but of like, money. But, like, you oh, do... That is I mean, sick. it looks so cool. But you do have to step up into it, right? You know yeah, what? Yeah, but that damn thing's I'll tall. step up you into step a car. Into you know thing. what I won't do? Fucking fall on the ground into one. Yeah, that's yeah, more no. of the speed of this. These things I don't are like that either. Too. That's They're why I drive big. an SUV, because I want to step up and not like sit down. I just want to step into my car. I yeah, don't. but if you had that car, you'd be yeah. like, you'd be down for the that's inconvenience, because it's so dope. Yeah. That car is You're only like super taking cool. it out a couple times yeah. a year. Yeah, if you have 10 mil to buy one car with... <laughs> and you choose that car you Mercedes, don't really care bring it back why no they did look up They're, the sls did, so they did yeah but it sort doesn't of. look like that it also looks fucking awesome does it mercedes I guess. sls look at this car oh SLS okay AMG. that I, car how, is sick. how do i not know about this car i don't Sorry, know this we... came out in what oh eight oh nine that thing is sick yeah these are also they didn't make that many and they're outrageously expensive oh but man you know that's a cool color work that hard sick <laughs> yeah bjorn get up earlier yeah pick take our yeah, cold shower by the boots avocado toast bjorn <laughs> <laughs> yeah if you would fucking drink meditate. less coffee you would, you would fucking lift. afford 10 of those dude <laughs> if you just quit drinking starbucks <laughs> yeah. what the fuck are you even doing <laughs> just just cut starbucks out of your life and you could afford this yeah. <laughs> i love nick's self-help advice yeah yeah, yeah. It's quick and to the point. Yeah. 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 It's, so it's bullshit advice. It's I love bad it. Advice, yeah. but it's funny. Um. So Eliza, is there anything yeah. you want to plug before? Was that the last fit? No, that was it. Thanks okay, for playing. Cool. That was yeah, fun. I hope you guys have fun, fun doing you. that. Do you have anything you want to plug before we get out of here? Um. We have a show called Bangers, and we mm-hmm. have a TikTok for Bangers, and an Instagram mm-hmm. for Bangers, which is very good thanks to Paul's unceasing efforts. Um. Yeah. And just my socials are Eliza isn't funny on different platforms and wherever people flee from from twitter i'm gonna try and get there first so i get my name <laughs> yeah right <laughs> like you have this like my brand I have it's to, like, like tumblr comes back and like oh fuck no it, <laughs> no tumblr has come back um but oh, I, oh, I still shit. that's still that's not Any the place on for my or, well no one's no, ruined no reddit anymore. yet thank god well reddit ruined itself come ah, on reddit's the shit <laughs> reddit they've been making fun itself. of elon no, endlessly that's true fun. yeah no i'm on reddit all the time but oh like, yeah they're yeah. so good yes so yeah no that's it just yeah follow my socials and engage with my content awesome, <laughs> awesome. Paul, you want to take us out yeah um thanks for uh listening watching uh, again please uh subscribe um and hit that like button that really helps us and leave your comments uh good bad whatever it just helps our algorithm <laughs> yeah. so thank you so it much it also helps us build this content <laughs> yeah. yeah it does <laughs> um, we got like 20 minutes off and, that stuff. <laughs> and also last but not least if you can do us a big favor at the bottom of this video there is a link um, it's to GoFundMe. We want to open a deli slash laundromat called Meat Spin. And, and you just click on the link. It'll explain everything. Thanks for watching.